Okay. Okay. I'm not. <laughs> Yo, what's a rape? <laughs> please, please, buddy, you mother please, sucker. No, please no, please no. <laughs> I'm crazy. I'm crazy. Please, please. <laughs> I'm killing anyone. <laughs> Just to break it even more. <laughs> Where are the other crabs? I'm only found four crabs. Wait, I can catch up on the camera. Die, camera, die! Say hello to my little friend. I feel like a Terminator. I feel like it's like a really scuffed Terminator. The midget with the ketchup bottle. No, no. Midget fight. This is definitely legal. Samurai. <laughs> I am become samurai. Help! Help me! Guys, guys please. I, 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 Dead. I, I, <laughs> I, I died. I didn't know. I didn't know that if you hold the. Oh! Wait, my screen went black. Is it black on stream? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah I told you. It's the news, brother. <laughs> the new thing at all. <laughs> Server close. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. Yeah, yeah. I would do. I would love nothing more, Para, than to be able to stream the Discord meme channel for like two hours and just like go through it all. That would be really fun. Yeah. Ha! Got him. Look out the window. I thought it was gonna be a jump. What? <laughs> ah. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Okay, listen, listen. It's a waste of a palette, but I want to effing kill this dude. Right, here, go, go. Yeah. Come on, baby. <laughs> Yo, get dunked on! Yo, we got it, dude. Yeah. Cause she was always. <laughs> nice to see you guys. It's been it's been a while. Welcome to the us uh, uh, setting up the intros, you know, and we fucking it up because I started on time. <laughs> Wait, where you, where are you? Are you downstairs? Yeah, I'm downstairs. Come on, oh. come down here. Come oh, on. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, give me one sec. Okay, here. <laughs> oh, frick! <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to do a hand? <laughs> Done. <laughs> Sorry, right. well, well. <laughs> yeah, well done, man. Well done. You okay? You good? I have brain damage. I'm ready to go, though. Fuck yeah. All right. Nice. Like, what are we doing today? All right. Uh, probably like uh, going on an adventure. Like, uh, have you seen Dora? No, I, I haven't. Okay, I so it's fine. Uh, we'll explain Dora to you. So basically, there's this girl, and she says "bate bate chocolate," and they go on a wild adventure to find Grandma's house. Does that make sense? Now, the important thing to note is that there's a fox that tries to steal their virginity. I mean, their belongings. <laughs> But his name is Swiper, all right? Whenever, whenever, so you gotta remember, if you ever see anyone sneak up on you, you have to put your palm out them and say, Swiper, no swiping three times. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. They would have to be okay. very, very evil to still punish you at that point. 
All right, so we're gonna try Nothing it out right now. All right. Okay. All right, here we go. So what we're gonna do right now is uh, we're gonna come a little bit closer this way, and then we're gonna put our hand out, and say swipe or no Shut swiping. Up! Okay. All right. All right. Whenever, Ready, whenever, set, whenever. go. Bloody. I'm swiper. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, swiper, no swiping. <laughs> swiper, no. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? I wait. You didn't let me even fucking finish. Hey, yeah, on. I know. Oh, Welcome to the real world, kid. This is an epic collab. I'm a VTuber. No, What's up? Swiper, no swiping. Swiper, stop! Swiper, stop! Swiper, stop! You're bashing me. I didn't... Hey, I'm sorry, come back. I didn't know that, that that's what would happen. Oh, okay, cool. Wait, are you the fox? Wait, I'm are pretty you foxy. a fox? Yeah. Wait, I thought... Wait, are you a fox or a cat? Okay, we're not starting this again. We're not... We're not doing this! I don't know my own pedigree. I'm so sorry. Uh, what am I? <laughs> I? I genuinely... I thought... I thought... Well, anyway. So, yeah. This is... Hi. Hi. All right, Mother Chugger. So, listen up, Mother Chugger chat. This is Lena Lazar. I think she's very spooky. She's got needles in her hair. Uh, I think she might, like, uh, murder you. I don't know truly uh, what the character is. So, how about you tell me a little bit more about yourself? What the frick's the situation? Like, the character lore kind of thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm kind of curious. Why do you have needles in your hair? What are those used for? Oh my god. Okay, I have the most, like, kawaii-esque music upon your suggestion. Huge. And this is gonna be totally opposite. I'm ready. Whenever, whenever. Um, okay. <clears throat> Hello? So, uh, this is really fucking weird listening mm -hmm. to this shit. Um, so I have ulcer colitis, right? Ulcer colitis. Is that- guys, is it too fucking loud? I feel like it's just really loud. What? What's loud? One second. Is okay. the music loud? <laughs> Oh, uh, please tell me it's not Chad, loud. Chad, she has schizophrenia, and I have HDMI, so I think we're pretty much qualified to hang out together. Oh, oh, hey, what? Hey. Hi. <laughs> all right. Um. Yeah. So I have uh -huh. I have ulcerative colitis, and that's the inflammation of all or parts of a large intestine. Mm -hmm. And I got diagnosed when I was. 15, so in like 2005. Wait, this is like and an actual confession. Okay, continue. No, this, this, is, this is my lore, right? <laughs> Write this down, chat. Uh -huh. it's, it's real. And so when I was diagnosed, I was in the hospital for about four months. Mm -hmm. So much to the point, they put me in this room called the whenever, butterfly room. Whenever, whenever, it's for cancer whenever, patients whenever. that they think they're they're going to die, right? So I was oh. there for a while because they couldn't figure out what was going on with me. I had a total of like 23 blood transfusions. Mm -hmm. And I was constantly hooked up to cables and shit. And every morning at 5 a.m., they'd come in with needles and take my blood. So, <clears throat> there's another variation of me where my intestines are out and like my uh, chest is open and I've got like IVs and syringes. So whenever, it's all kind whenever, of encompassing my disease into my VTuber mm. model. Oh, I thought those were for spreading Ebola. You kind of just like, and then you're like, congratulations, new STD unlocked, you know? That was what I was thinking at first, and I thought that maybe I should go with the more whenever, honest route. Oh, <laughs> okay, fuck. <Yeah. laughs> nice. That's a big bomb to drop in the beginning. I don't know how else to put that, you know what I mean? I but get yeah, it. That's it. She wears her life upon her sleeve and in her hair, and sometimes outside of herself. It's very deep. She likes to think outside the box and outside the body. <laughs> Yeah, you got it, man. Yeah, yeah. And uh, for you guys, hi, if you don't know me, I'm Fillion. I'm short, I'm hyper, I like fruit snacks, and also whenever, sometimes whenever, I do like, stuff like, like this. I have no lore! I'm just a cat girl on the internet, I guess. And that's about all we got, so... <laughs> Dude, so the fruit stacks is a real fucking thing. We were setting up, and yes. she was like making these crinkly Wait, sounds. don't sell me out! <laughs> oh. And it was potato chips. Yeah, it was potato chips, chat. I don't have an addiction. It's all a funny stream joke. Who the frick would yeah. actually eat fruit snacks? Chat, one of you eat fruit snacks. I better see nothing but twos. I don't think I've ever had fruit snacks okay. in my life. You haven't? I mean, of course you haven't. They're awful. <laughs> yeah, you snacks. better eat some right now, you frick. You understand? I will find out where you live. I will come into your house. I will feed your puppy fruit snacks. And then not only... Uh, what are you doing? Stop. Stop. Stop being taller than me. <laughs> <laughs> ha! What? Uh, wait, stop. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Frick. Please. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I didn't ask for this. <laughs> uh, okay, so I... Uh, 
uh, I guess we 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 figured out who asserted dominance here. Uh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> It's like a, it's like a, like a bully trying to pick on you at a playground, and all they do is they hold their hand out. I'm just like, honestly, I thought it'd be opposite, but hey, here we are. That yeah, was okay. Cool. Wow, I got stepped on pretty fast. You know, the last time I hung out with the VTuber, they did like a dummy mommy voice, and I was like, I was like, I was like, chat, I get girls all the time. She's like, really? She did a dummy mommy voice? And I was just like, <gasps> like five <laughs> seconds later. Remu, I love Remu. Holy <laughs> shit. She, have you seen her thighs, bro? They're so. <sighs> Yeah, remember like that Spongebob episode where they're eating burgers and the uh, Spongebob's yes. like, Look out, Squidward! They go to the thighs! Yeah, yeah. yeah he was like this fucking big. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah Remichi walked out that burger factory. Shut fucking, up! Yep, and I'm okay with it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, what was that before like, we were talking? Like, you were talking about like Final Destination level of junk with like the laser eyes and stuff like that. What was yeah, the situation dude. there? I that I like I really would want to get laser eye surgery, but I, I just can't do it after seeing that movie. Like she legit, like her entire face was burned off through the laser machine thing. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what we talk about when we're not like on stream. We talk about like laser eyes and stuff. I was like, Superman's really poggers. He shoots the ray beams and stuff, and she's like, I saw a movie where that you got his entire face melted off, and then he fell out of a window. Yeah. yeah, I don't know how she escalated from that to a window, but she fell out the window from like a big building and she died. <laughs> Listen yeah. up, chat. Every year, people do not die from their face getting melted off. They die from falling out of a window as a result of their face getting melted off. So if your face does get melted off, remember to remain calm, drop, and roll. Call 911 and avoid any windows at all costs. This has been yep. your life advice from a couple of YouTubers. You're welcome. Nice. Okay. Uh, yeah, and that also reminds me of like a <laughs> like scary movie a long time ago. <laughs> there is a stupid scene in it where the dad guy falls out the window. He's like, he's like, she's like, she's like so depressed and he's done with life. So he tries to pop a bunch of effing pills and OD or some junk, but he accidentally pops a bunch of Viagra. So, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> so the dude, Wait, I think I remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so the dude like, like looks down and he just sees like his entire like, and it's legit like an having Italian sausage and a half just like poking out. And he's like, ah, oh, oh, frick. oh no. And then, <laughs> And then like this oh cat God, jumps on it from across the room. If you have cat owners, look out. And having turned his pee pee into a scratching post. Oh, so my that's male, right. Yeah, yeah, my male is flailing around with an entire scratching post Bruh. cat on him. And uh, as he's oh, flailing around, fuck. he falls the frick out of a window. <laughs> God damn it, man. And he lands on the ground and he's suspended by his pee pee and he's bent over it at like an acute angle. And, <laughs> and turned him into an effing TP, literally, or a tent or some junk. Whenever, That's whenever, fucking whenever, yucky. Like, like, yeah. Don't, don't they have like Shut fucking up. 10 scary movies now? I, I don't know. They have a lot. I, I don't remember. I think I've only seen the first one. I think it, like I was kind of grossed out with the dude with the little thumb and he like put it in the fucking pie and was like. He what? He fingered a pie? That's horrible. Scary, dude, it's in scary movie. What do you mean? It's what? like the dude with the weird like arm and it's got he's got like his little fingers that are like nubs and he's like serving them dinner and he like puts his weird He's gross got finger fingers that are pie. nubs? No, it no, that's Where not, does fingers go? Like I don't know. It's like this weird they like made it specifically look yucky and his oh, arms kind of like this. And I, yeah, I don't know how to Anyway, so he fingered a pie. Finger to pie. And it was, I never watched any other scary movie after that. So. <laughs> yeah. Do you have like PTSD from like watching scary movies as a kid that like you still carry with you to this day? Because I got some bad, <laughs> some bad ones from that. I think the only thing I have is when I used to watch like um, Japanese horror whenever, films. Whenever, so whenever, always like the little like peeking from closet doors and shit. It's or like true. if you're in a cabinet and there's like just a little bit of Yo, blackness in the cabinet and I just feel like shit. someone's watching me. What Other than that, no. Got it. Yeah, I remember like I saw like I was at my friend's place and they were watching like the Texas Chainsaw Massacre movie and I had no idea what the frick that was. I said, hey, can I watch that? And then I'm like, they're like, you don't want to watch it. And I see on the screen this poor girl walks up to like a police officer and they're like, there's a bad man in the meat factory. Oh. And I never knew what the movie was about, but that line haunted my brain to this day. <laughs> I was like, what did it mean? <laughs> Who is the bad man? Where's the meat factory? Where are her parents? And uh, I still think about that sometimes. Whenever, 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 whenever.
what the like fuck? Are, so have you like not really been into horror or do you like horror? Stuff. Like what's the status on that? I like horror. Like don't you do like horror VTubing stuff too? I like horror, but I, I don't usually like um watch too much of it right now because I just kind of stopped watching movies. But uh, I used to love horror a lot. Yeah. Okay. All right. I respect that. Yeah. Horror, horror's like it's okay, I guess. I mean, it's not it's not like the best or anything. So I, um, I feel a, like she's lying to me. Okay, okay. Stop kicking your leg around like that. I get it. I get it. I get it. Tell me about your horror VTubing. Is that a thing for you? Or? Oh, no, not at all. You know, horror's mm -hmm. just, it's just, you know, it's just kind of cool. That's all. It's just like, it's like, it's, you know, I don't have time for it these days, though. Chad, so does I'm, anyone I'm know her? You. Does anyone know Lena? Please tell me. Is she lying to me right now? Is she capping? I can't tell. Wait, where'd she go? She walked off the camera. Come back! Yes, who? Sus. She's obsessed with horror. Okay, listen, come over here, you mother sucker. You, you, everyone said you're lying right now. They're calling you out in 4K. Can you tell me what you're talking about right now? Whenever, whenever. No, I don't, I don't, I, um, I like playing and packing. Mm -hmm. Sometimes all guys. And you know what? Among Us is something that I will play once a month. Do you like Among Us? <laughs> Why are you capping so hard? <laughs> come back. Wait, wait, do you have dark deeds planned for today's stream? Am I gonna be in danger? Like, what's happening? Why are you like not- Uh-huh, uh okay. No. Chat, if she tries to throw me in a potion or strap me down to a table, you guys gotta call the cops immediately, you understand? <laughs> Listen, I ain't gonna get turned to frog stew or like turned into like an effing uh, science experiment. <laughs> I, I would- I would never. Uh-huh. Mm. Got yeah. it. So I got a question for you though. That'll really determine a lot of things. What's up? Is it morbing time? Ooh. Whenever, 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 Poggy Woggy. I'm sorry? Is it morbing time? I don't think she knows that it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you know that meme or not? I can't tell. What's yeah. What's a morb? What's a morb? Uh oh. Hey yo, what the uh, fuck? Ch Ch like that one part in that one movie where he actually says it's fucking morbin time. Yep. Oh, she does know it. Wait, she's cultured. Okay, we got it. We got to chat. The meme is dead, but she still knows it. So we're good. We're good. We're good. <laughs> You wait, people are telling me Robin's thighs are still on my stream. I gotta fix that. Wait, frick. Wait, Rob's thighs? Robin's what? thighs. I was doing You thighs? Laugh, You Lose um the other day. There you go. Uh and basically we watched like a Lego Batman video where he had like a Batman like a like Robin, like a Lego Robin kind of guy. Except it was a Stolfo. It was a Stolfo. And my entire chat kept talking about a Stolfo Robin's thighs. To the point where when I lost my You Laugh You Lose, I had to put up an image on my stream of chat's choice. And they just wanted a Stolfo's thighs on it. So, I just had thighs on my stream from like a 2D anime girl for like the entire stream. Which I guess First is... of all, what? I, huh? the only word I understood out of that was anime girl. Second of all, what's a Stolfo? Oh, a Stolfo's the cutest kawaii, most cutest girl ever on the history of girls. You understand? I can show you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Show me. Show yeah, me. Yeah, okay, okay, good. Cool. You should pull it up on your own browser, or I can send it on Discord. I mean, either way it works. Let me come over here. Okay. A Stolfo cute. Wait, this is going to give me some bad results. All right, I got to be careful here. <clears throat> Images! Whenever, whenever, like, Perfect. Dang, look how kawaii Astolfo is. She's so cute. Um, copy image. Send Ooh. to Lena. There it is. Why is everyone putting girl in parentheses? What do you mean? No, 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 they're just literally jealous. They're all, they're all haters, TBH. Okay, you know what? Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> what? Alright, this is gonna be, you know, a stream where I don't know who's telling what truth. True! It's like truth or dare, except it's just like us doing stupid things and like lying to each other. The whole stream. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, fucking. Alright. Well, she. Wait, what is the he gal face? Um. Yeah. Hi. No, I'm okay, like. What's an a he gal face? No, no, I googled a Stolfo and I already see a he gal on the first page. I'm like five seconds from getting banned on Twitch if I scroll down anymore. <laughs> Holy oh, frick. Okay, uh, we're gonna we're gonna close that out. So, what do you think about a Stolfo? Is she cute? Yeah, she's pretty cute. Yeah. 
Do what like, what is she from? And what anime is she from? I don't know what anime she's from, but I but like but like, do you like like pink hair? Uh, mm -hmm. it's all right. Yeah, it's okay. Do you like mutes in VR chat? Yeah, I do. Mutes are fucking rad. Mutes yeah, yeah. Really yeah. Cool. So basically, you take a mute in VR chat, you give them pink hair, and then you make them unmute their mic. Judgmentally, are you processing it or? Okay. And we are. I don't know, I don't know what that means. You don't know what that means? Um, no. Well, let's see. We're gonna go through the history of all the mute voice reveals, uh, starting from 2018 to 2022. First off, we have mute number one, which was a guy. We had mute number two, which was a guy. We had mute number three, which was a guy, and then mute number four, which was a guy. So I think we have a little bit of a trend oh. here through history. Does that make sense? Wait, so is that enemy <laughs> character a guy? Yeah. Bro, I told you this is gonna be tough. I, <laughs> I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Fucking anything. Wait, you you wait, signed up for this. Bro. I have a you new idea. I have a new idea. What we're gonna do is we're gonna grab Lena. We're gonna show her a bunch of anime characters. She's gonna guess guy or girl. Dude, that is oh. uh, top-notch gameplay right there. Oh, She's oh. a guy. True. <laughs> Fucking hell. Okay. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you, did you tell everyone how you asked me to do this fucking collab? Uh, no, I, I, I asked her. We, we were at a restaurant eating some dinner, and I said, This is really great steak. You wanna collaborate? <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. Haha, <laughs> right? Wait, where are you going? Hi. That was a story, I, right? Yeah. But yeah, we. Yep. Yeah. Like, did we have virtual steak or it was IRL? I can't remember. Uh, it was, I think it was virtual. Um, yeah. Okay, yeah, good story. That is exactly why we're here today. Okay, great. Nailed it. Chat, it's the real story. I pro Chat, stop. It's the real story. We were just having a good time. We were hanging out. It was at a virtual club, basically. And we were eating... We were looking at some steak, some really good steak. Right. What was that? I had a... Uh, okay, why don't you I tell the story then, huh? Why don't you tell the story? Okay. Wait, I was... Uh, yeah, no? Uh, you, uh, I trust you. You know I will always tell the truth, right? Yeah, she tells the truth, chat. All right, tell him the, feed him the story. Feed him the fake one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We were at a party. Yep. And I was uh, with my friend next yep. to him, and this lady was backing her ass up in our faces. Wait, like, full on open legs. This is what? not. This is not the fake story. <laughs> I told you I was gonna tell the truth. Uh, okay. Uh, and then what? Then Fillion comes in like. That's hey. me. Hey. Hey. And I and I and I look at her and I'm like, hey, Fillion, and she goes. Do you want to collab? Like that. In the middle of, you know, legs being open in my face. Yeah. And I said, okay. Yeah. And that was it. The here, and then we, here we are today. That's she, the story. <laughs> she was sitting on a chair with a girl twerking in her face like this. Like, like, ooh, ooh, ooh. And I just rolled up on her like an effing NPC from GTA and gave her a side quest. I said, Lena Lazar, you want to do a collab? And she's like, yeah. And then the girl farted. And then uh, I, I was like, cool. And <laughs> Yep. <laughs> and, and, that's, <laughs> and that's literally yep. how it went. It was so scary. Yeah, I, I said it was like a dumb joke, and then afterwards I realized like, wait, we should actually, that'd be funny. <laughs> and here we are! Who asked me to collab as a joke? Oh my god. Well, no, I thought it was like, it was like, it was funny because... Uh, wait, come back. No, 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 come back, please, please, please. We, we should still do the collab, come on. You want to like, make it happen still? Like, we can, I was joking, but like, we can, what? Huh? What? <laughs> you should really want to... Wait! No, 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 Okay, wait, give me one second. I gotta do damage control. Chat, oh, chat, she, like, really, we're really great friends. Uh, we, uh, do we, 
uh, give me one sec. Uh, <laughs> later you get back here right now, and you make this joke happen. You're tarnishing my reputation live on stream. Alright, good. Emotional Alright, chat, we worked out of our differences. I think we're ready to go. Uh, so, yeah, I think... <laughs> Emotional. I think, I think we're ready to go. Are we not? Yeah. Lena, blink yeah. twice if you need help. Lena, blink twice if you're having a good time. She's not blinking. Lena, please blink twice. Please, please blink twice. You're not blinking. Uh, she's just okay. Uh, it's it's fine. It's fine. We're all. I know how to blink on this model. Oh really? Oh, do you know have facial no expressions? Hmm. Do I? Let me see. Expression. It might be just your luck. Let me see. Option. Yeah. Oop. 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 Opa oh, Gundam style. On this model. Oh. Well, there we very go. Very cool. Very cool. Yep. yep. All right. Wait, so you haven't blinked once this entire time? I don't think so. I, I will never be able to unsee it. Wait, let's have a staring contest. You ready? You ready? You ready? ready? One, two, three, go. No, yeah. That's it. I blinked. No! I didn't blink on my <laughs> screen. Frick. <laughs> I want a refund. All right, whatever, man. I'm warming so hard right now. That's really cool, Pan. Which is keep it up, man. It's like Internet Explorer over there. All right. <clears throat> so today, chat, we have gathered here because of you guys. Today, we are going to be reading out your cringe, embarrassing, debilitatingly funny stories that you guys submitted of your own accord. If you say, how did you effing get that? I'm gonna sue you for $28.50 billion. Like Elon Musk is getting sued over Dogecoin right now. We will get you banned from the stream and oppress the truth ruthlessly. Does that make sense? So all the stories that you guys sent in are 100% real and 100% voluntary. There is no bribery involved. And today chat, we're gonna be reading them, reviewing them, going through them, dissecting them, and letting the truth be out there. So that is pretty much the situation. Would you like to add anything to this before we get started? Uh, uh, there are a lot of shit stories. That, I don't know what that's about. That's but so I'm ready true! <laughs> Chat! I asked you guys to send in stories and every other f stories. Like, I tried to fart, but then I should. I kid you guys not. <laughs> it is so embarrassing. I, I could not look through the stories about feces. Fucking jeez, man. Yeah, it's like... <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I'm looking forward to these. Mm -hmm. I don't think I've ever done, like, a, anything like this before, so I'm stoked to see what uh -huh. people went through. Exactly. Make fun of them. We're gonna find out today, chat. Now listen, every time someone has a fart story or a poop story, I will literally gift one sub at the end of the stream for every single one of them. Chat, if you made me go broke, I'm never doing this again. You understand? Good. All right. <laughs> Ready? Yeah, they put a fart sound effect. <laughs> uh -huh. All right. Okay, here we go. First story chat. We're going to go through it right now. All right, we can take Wait. turns reading. Yeah. I'll grab the first one. First. All right, here we go. Yeah. Here is it worth giving you a fabulous <sighs> sub? Five or six years ago, I went on a summer camp where you could pick a dance as an activity. So I joined and did a bunch of Fortnite dances. Okay, so we're starting out pretty strong right now. We literally have a kid effing busting out the ninja dance moves. This must have been the height of 2018 back here. It's effing calling for this story. Uh, <laughs> my man went in Fortnite dance. So that's the classic start. We know the average age of my audience is probably around the age of a Fortnite kid. So this all makes sense so far. At the end of every week, they give out awards to kids in certain activities. That's pretty cool. Did he win the cringe award? Let's find out. When they got to the dance activity, they called my name and I went up on stage. You won a competition <laughs> by Fortnite dancing! Oh my, this must have been early on in the meta. This kid was ahead of the meta, ahead of the pack, an absolute pack leader, a, a, a tyrant of the industry of Fortnite dancing. After accepting his prestigious award, he started doing Fortnite dances in front of the entire camp. I, I, I feel like that would like haunt me like I would I would that would stick with me for the rest of my life Yeah, true Is that counted as like plagiarism though like plagiarism being a, a dance and he just like he didn't even it was like he copied it and everyone loved it 
Is that okay? I guess that's true, but when you're working with a bunch of boomers that have never seen a ninja in their life, you can get away with it. So that makes sense. That's that the truth, right? The, mm -hmm. the boomers fucking loved it. They loved the, the Z Gen Z dances. Of course they right? did. Chat, let the truth be known. Boomers love Gen Z dancing. That's a certified fact. Ooh. So now, chat, listen. Fortnite dancing on stream is cringe. You should never do it. However, I'm going to give you some instruction, okay? So what you're going to want to do is never do this. <laughs> or this. Whenever, whenever, whenever. Plug, plug. Or, or this. <laughs> or this. Or this. And especially not this one. You understand, chat? Now, this story may have been submitted by me. It may not have been submitted by me. But the truth will really never be known. Because, of course, I would never submit stories from my own viewer confession. Because I don't watch my own stream. It's too cringe. Can you teach me how to do that last one? I actually am kind of intrigued by that one. <laughs> really? Okay. Yeah, that was kind of cool. <laughs> wait, dude! Okay, wait. We're going to turn Lena into a Fortnite dancer live on stream. Wait a second. <laughs> Okay, so what you're gonna want to do is you want to just like learn to pump your arms up and down. That's the first step Yeah, act like a bird that's just trying to take off vertically for some reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right now what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to just like whenever, step whenever, whenever, Paul, you step to... Yeah, 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 why, why, and then you just why, pump why? when you step Hey, 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 yeah, 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 you kind of got, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Ooh. now pretty much all you do is you just whenever, point whenever, while doing the steps still. Hey, Fillion, thanks for your I keep content. pointing? Like, yeah, you just, you just point real quick. Yeah, 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 yeah. It really makes me smile with amusement. Ooh, 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 okay, content. now you just throw the clap Have in there while you're day. stepping. Just throw the clap in there while you're stepping. Hey, and then, and then you just hop to the little arms across. Yeah, hey, sick. Now, chat, watch this. She's gonna put it together live on the stream. See, if you ever wanted lessons from Fillion, this is a freebie. Lena, I will be expecting 50 bucks on my PayPal after this. However, we're ready to go. Hit him with the Fortnite dance. Ooh, ooh, ooh. She, 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 she pointed, she pointed, she pointed. She's going down. Oh, ah! <laughs> you know, that's gonna get clipped and haunt you for the rest of your life, right? Yeah. All right. Well, yeah. she's living it up. <laughs> <sighs> exercise for the entire month. Okay. Uh, very well done. All right. Thanks, man. You're a great coach. Yeah, no problem. All right. Coach. Make sure to pay me. Okay. Next story. Sweet. One, two, three. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she's going to have no idea. Go. Go. I next to that one. What's that about? Uh, well, which one do you see? You should read it out. <laughs> I secretly want to eradicate Jim with Windex. Yeah. Okay, so uh, this is, um, you know, we took stories from both Lena's um, community and from mine. This one came from mine. Basically, what happened was that I was eating from the fruit snacks off the floor. You know, like the five-second rule, the five-minute rule, the five-day rule, the five-week. You, you get it, right? So I was eating them off the floor, and I looked up at my wall, and I see nothing less than a massive spider, like an inch and a half long. Shut up! Crawling the frick up my wall. It was like my fever dreams unleashed themselves and were now having sex with my wall. You understand? And I didn't know what to do. I froze up in fear and I said, where's Lena? I think she can handle the situation. But she wasn't there. She was too busy getting twerked on. Right? Yes. Right. So I let the spider go. And the next day, Lena, I kid you not, I was taking a shower. And I looked at my wall behind me in the shower, and there's nothing less than this massive epic spider on the wall behind me. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I was legit dying. So, so my community, like, uh, I, I took a picture of it and posted it in my Discord, and they named it Jim. So I showered with a guy named Jim or a spider. Um, you kept showering? There's no way anyone yeah, could have paid me enough money. To no, I, what I the fuck? Why did you stay in there? Because if I got out of the water, it would kill me. We all know a spider's weakness is water. 
No, 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 no. Okay. No. no. I, what if it jumped on you while you were in the shower, even though you were wet because you weren't the shower, you were just person in the shower, well, and you could have died while I, you were showering? It would have gotten reflected. It would have gotten reflected by the massive brain waves radiating from my five head cranium. So I think we would have been just fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So as you can see, chat, I had the situation under control. I wasn't screaming for my life. I wasn't literally on the verge of death. It was all good. So then fast forward a day later and I see Jim again, this time crawling right above my microwave while I'm trying to microwave food. It's like an effing bad omen. It's like the effing seventh bubonic plague is about to hit me right now. And there's nothing I can do to stop it. So <laughs> yeah, my community kind of loves Jim more than me. Uh, what else is new? And uh, that's... That's where that story First. came from. Yeah. Okay. I don't like that. You take the next one. Ready, set, go. So, my parents were moving into this new apartment and uh, NC when I was younger to get closer to my school. So, when we first entered the apartment, I immediately saw the balcony. Now, I don't know what turned off in my brain but I turned into a child mode and ran straight towards the balcony yelling, oh, BALCONY! And then I hit head first into the glass window and I genuinely don't know why I did that, but I swear that the balcony window was invisible and I'd hire those cleaners if I knew who they were. It's like a kid when he sees tits for the first time. <laughs> Dude, I've actually seen this in person before. Oh, wait, and really? I feel really bad. Yeah, it was at like a slumber party when I was really young, but yeah. just all of us like little girls. And we we're outside, and then I think she just didn't know that the door was closed, and she ran into it, and we all started laughing, but then we realized maybe that wasn't nice. But that is the funniest thing to see someone just, like, with full force, just walk straight into a fucking wall. <laughs> That's fucking what it is, right? Girl. If you think about it, the glass is literally just a wall. So if you imagine, like, a brick wall instead of glass, it just gets eight times funnier. It's like the ultimate donut wall. <laughs> Fucking god, man. I feel bad. I don't know what I would have done if I was if I was with this person. I'm sorry that happened. Uh, probably, like, pick them up and then, like, let them fall over again and then, like, point and laugh like a high school bully. That's a pretty good oh option. Oh my god. <laughs> Were you a bully in school? No, I was the farthest thing from a bully. I was super quiet and I just sat in the back. Yo, I kid you not. <laughs> Oh, oh how the turns shit. have tabled at this time. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is back in like middle school. All right Next story Oh chat, I'm giving a sub. All right, congratulations. You oh, guys earned yourselves a God. sub. Here it is. It's oh, the first poop story here of many more to come uh, All right, let's read about this person's bowel movement one time. I pooped in a bush This is already off to a great start uh, When I was a mile away from bathrooms on a hike and a puppy wait what? came up behind me and started lick licking me what so oh. that well, <laughs> so that I adopted her and her name is Miso bro what is this anime story this is so weird she's really weird but yeah yeah she's an effing freak what <laughs> So, so, wait, okay, hold on. There's a lot to digest, and we haven't even finished this. Okay. Yeah, she was done Hang digesting. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so, you're, a, like, a puppy came out of nowhere yeah. and started licking their ass while they're shitting? <laughs> I guess so. And then instead of being afraid or confused, they effing turn into, like, who you call her? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's like it's like oh. Rapunzel or some junk with animals. They'd be like, oh, and like entrance this animal and decide to bring it home and name it Miso. How do you explain that to your friends? Do you really tell them you were literally taking a dump and then a dog came up to you and you adopted it? Or do you say something like, oh, we found her in an effing shelter. She was abandoned by her family and we saved her from getting put down. Like, y you gotta lie about that at some level, right? There's no way. That seems... <laughs> I'm not sure I would tell that story to my friends, like how I got the dog. Yeah. yeah, the dog ate my shit. It was pretty cool. We got along really well. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> I don't know if I'd even adopt that dog if it ate my shit. I'd just be uh, like, you're gross. Wait, they didn't say that part. Come on. Oh, chat. No, no, no. It's okay, chat. I figured it out. That person's just a furry. It's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. And Jeez. the dog was his uncle. Okay. Wait. Oh, yeah. One time I walked in... <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, one time I walked in the men's bathroom and got stuck in there because I didn't realize, and then a ton of men walked in. Wait! Is Wh someone claiming to be a female and watching our streams? Oh, no, that's not... that can't be right. <laughs> Wait, what is, what is your gender distribution for your stream? I actually don't know. Oh. I don't have any idea. Mine's like, mine's like 80 male, 20 girls, like... <laughs> But we all know there ain't no female viewers. Come on now. Chat, what if you're a girl? Mods Ben, everyone's saying one. If you're a female, it, well, now everyone's gonna say it. How many of you guys are women? Why do my mods say one? Macroween, I literally talked to you in voice. If you don't got a donger, nobody do. Come on. <laughs> whenever, whenever, whenever. Yeah, hey, there's a few of them. Mm hmm. There's three. Yeah, there's they would never lie on the internet. Oh, there's three? That's cute. That means you can ban them all. Let's go. <laughs> what? It'll be funny. It'll be funny. Like we just we we do the funny band thing, and then like they're like, "Haha, I got banned." Like, okay, next story with Lana Lazar. Let's read it. Uh -huh. <sighs> the real horror is whether or not I'm gonna get canceled this stream. Let's find out. Holy shit! Have you been around someone that's been like the straight man for you? That's been like what? The straight man. You know, it's a role that you play whenever someone's quite like um, lots of energy and popping the jokes, and you've got just like one silent dude who's pretty a little bit like opposite to balance the levels, you know? So you're like, you're doing your thing, you're making jokes, and you know, you got the straight man who's just kind of like. Yeah, man, I love crayons! Hell yeah! Heck yeah! Hi, I hate my life! Wow. Bad. <laughs> I hate my life. That's how you start the story. Sounds good. This is like an FML reading. All right. What's it say? I have a terrible job and I work minimal wage. My coworkers hate me. My God boss dang. doesn't. Pay God damn. What is? What? This is like trauma is dumping this? live on stream. <laughs> what, what is this? I thought it's okay. Uh, I can't get a driver's license. Uh huh. Uh, I've tried many times. Whenever, whenever, my only friend whenever, is an what? idiot. Uh, I work yeah. in a local fast. <sighs> Works in the local. F I mean, that's not a bad start. Like, you gotta start somewhere. I do take driving lessons, but that's all. But the worst part is, I live in a pineapple under the sea. Are you? Wait, did we just get got? Wait, they just ran the local. Bro, dude, chat, you freaks. You listen. This is supposed to be real Bro. stories only. You ruined the credibility of our stream. Lana's leaving, and call me your dad. <sighs> you wanna go back to that club? Yeah, let's go back to the fucking yeah, club. Fuck dude. Shit, yeah, man. dude. That is, they can't even I'm, I'm, lying I'm in my face. Alright, yeah. cool. Let's get twerked on. You got twerked on? Yeah, yeah. Let's go get twerked Remember on. Remember that time I twerked on someone? Me neither. Uh... Good stream, everyone. <laughs> Good stream, everyone. Wow. Thank you, chat, for the donut. <laughs> Holy let's frick. Go to the next one. Alright, next one! I was trying to call out to this girl who's trying to holla, 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 and she gave me a look and was ignoring me. Okay. Then she started throwing up gang signs. What? And then I was like, what are you trying to get into? Someone comes over and stops me because she says that she's deaf. <laughs> okay, I felt that like so deep in my oh soul. Oh my god. Yo, you're like, hey, yo, what up, girl? I'm trying to holla. And she just like. And you're like, bro, stop throwing up the gang signs. God dang. Oh my god. How much, like, so I feel bad. like if someone throws a gang sign, it's very obvious. But ASL is very, like, you know, intricate hand gesture. So I don't. I feel like anyone would realize the difference, maybe? We're coming to the conclusion, chat, that this person either doesn't know what a gang sign is. Or has literally never heard of an ASL. Because there is no way you mess that junk up. There is there is no possible way. If you do a gang sign, you're like, Let's go, the baby. Or you're like Jojo posing or some junk. Meanwhile, this person just like... <laughs> like, imagine like a small little girl just like waving her hands around like at like mid chest level. And then like does like a thing with her face. Like, come on. <laughs> Yeah, uh, there's no way everything. It's not a gang, gang sign. Signs. Yeah, I know. Hey, wait, Lena, I have a gang sign oh, for you. Okay. You ready? Tell me if you recognize yeah. this one, alright? Okay, close okay. your eyes. Close your eyes. Alright, ready, set. Tell me what the gang sign is. Ready, set, go. Wait, but, I, but I can't see. You gotta open up. You gotta open up here. 
Oh. Fuck you! <laughs> what the fuck? Why is this still a meme in 2022? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me right now? <laughs> Wait, don't walk into the portal. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what a paragraph? Oh wait, we didn't wait. Oh, dice skip ahead. Oops, dice key. Okay. Um, wait. Oh, we never finished the story. Okay, well, let me see. Someone comes over and tells me she's using sign language. I felt so bad, I ran out of the room. Too bad. I would fucking too. There's no way. <laughs> you would? No. Imagine. Imagine like a. <laughs> Imagine like, bro, she's deaf, and then she, you just run out the room. She was literally all from her perspective. All she saw was this human walked up, said, <laughs> <laughs> "You know, it's like that." It's whoa, like, whoa, like whoa, you would never know. You would never know why it just ran out. It's just like this person just burst into tears over nothing. You would probably wonder how effing ugly you were. You're like, I thought I was like a four out of ten, not like a negative eight. You know? Holy shit! So unless anyone translated it, she wouldn't know. Or maybe she was reading lips. But maybe I'd catch it be and and like maybe. Listen, if like that man not puff up, if that man can't re recognize ASL, then that girl does not have to read lips. She does not have to go that extra. Holy frick! A silent okay. voice, true. I wonder what that girl from a silent voice thought. It's like a it's an anime movie about a deaf girl. I wonder how confused she was. All right, next story. Holy shit. Man's wearing S's this out here. This is a really fucking long one. Okay. That's what she um, said. All right, let's get crack a in. A few years ago, I worked in the refrigerated section of... Wait, did you read the last one? I already forgot. I did. Okay. It's up a to few you. Years ago, I worked in the refrigerated section of a major grocery store. We had just received a delivery of dairy, and I was moving a full pallet of milk using the electronic forklift. Wait, or electric forklift. You kind of sound like you're like reading like um like an, an audio book. Can you do like a really like formal voice for it? I'm kind of curious. What's a formal voice mean? Like, like pretend like you're reading like an official audio book, you know? <clears throat> forklift certified, true. As I was taking it to our large walk-in <gasps> storage yeah. fridge, uh -huh. a coworker sudden pops out from behind the stacks. Oh. I slam onto the bricks so I don't run him over, <sighs> but the pallet was stacked poorly and the top half slides of the, of the bottom half, <gasps> easily 80 to 100 gallons of milk, hits the floor oh. and explodes. Sheesh. We both start screaming, no! no! As a wave of milk flows down the aisle, uh -huh. I grab my radio and I yell for help. And half of the team, including the manager, come running with mops and buckets. Nobody was injured but me. Two co-workers. Oh, no. The manager spent three hours mopping up milk. I was called Tsunami by a few members of the team after that. Okay, first off, that was really good. Second off, it wasn't milk. Any other questions, chat? <laughs> <laughs> Holy frick. This is like an actually crazy story. Chat, listen. If you think you're having a bad day, if you think those people that run the prank videos where they smash a couple gallons of milk on the floor are really the offenders, look at this man. This man did 50 times the damage with an having forklift. He's forklift certified, and he's also milk spillage certified. This man's an absolute mad lad, and he needs to get put behind bars. <laughs> I wouldn't like mine being called Tsunami. That's kind of a cool fucking name. Yeah, imagine that. They're like, they're like, yo, bro, what you in prison for? And he's like, they call me Tsunami. And you're like, Sheesh, okay, bro, what, why they call you Tsunami? And you're like, I was forklift certified. Then I spilt milk on the floor. <laughs> and they're like, they're like, okay, and then what, bro? And who'd you kill? And they're like, my job. <laughs> you, wait, you reckon he got fired? I uh, kind of surprised he didn't get fired. Yeah, I don't know, probably not. <laughs> Holy yeah, that's pretty God. intimidating. I wouldn't, I, I don't know. I don't know if I want to talk to someone named Tsunami. Yeah, I agree. Scary. Yeah. A guy named Tsunami, that sounds kind of cool. A girl named Tsunami, it's just like, who's your ex-boyfriend, you know? <laughs> All right, next story! Imagine, if you will, that a man, me... Oops, don't clip that. <laughs> <laughs> 
and his and his three friends, two girls and a dude, are hanging out at the girls' do college dorm. This man, me, frick, okay, stop, has a huge crush on one of the girls. This girl is making a lower wreath from fake flowers she got at a dollar store. Okay, that's random details. There were plenty of flowers around, so I had long since decided to place some in my hair and behind my ears. This is like a scene from Midsommar. This had caused a few laughs, especially from my crush, which made me very happy. <laughs> Okay. Uh -huh. You just, you take a flower, you put it behind your ears, she just cracks up laughing. <laughs> I, I want some of whatever they're on. <laughs> Alright. Eventually she needed the flowers in my hair and behind my ears, so she took them and said sorry. In my omniscience, that's a big word, I said, oh no, I've been deflowered. Yeah, that's my kind of humor. Wait, that's my kind of joke. Holy frick. This caused some eye rolls. Okay, well, not chat. They would really laugh. When they realized I had no idea what that very word meant, gut-wrenching laughter ensued as they tried to explain it in a very confused, dense man. <laughs> Uh, I kind of like that story. You know, chat, listen, there's some really embarrassing stories about a dog licking your butt while you're taking a dump, and then you got some really nice and calm stories about flowers and misunderstandings, you know? It, it, it could always be worse, so... Uh, mods, ban whoever sent in this story, way too PG for me. Yeah, I was about to say, like, this is supposed to be your most embarrassing story. True. It's like, hella embarrassing, and... If your most embarrassing story is being a virgin, I'm just gonna call you Jesus. Like, all right, next. What is it? Oh, okay, I think this is your story. <laughs> One time on. I made an egg sandwich. Uh, it was, it was delicious. Is having Gordon Ramsay? Like, what the frig? Okay. Let's get out of here. Chat, listen, thank you guys so much for the really intricate and detailed stories. I really like these embarrassing stories. You guys are absolutely killing it right now. Oh, wow, another gift that subbed to my chat. When I was four, and there's a fart noise, I was taking a bath with my friend, and I pooped in the tub. Okay, that's not that bad, I guess. That happened. You know, accidents happen. And we played with my poop. Uh... So like, <laughs> like that, like it happens, you know. Like accidents happen, but how do you like justify physically grabbing it with your hands and then experimenting with it like it's like play doh or something? How, how old do you have to be to be this effing dumb? I don't understand. <laughs> Why did anyone stop them? If they're like that age in a bathtub together, you think the parents would be like, okay, hold on, wait, this is not cool, and then like pick them up, get them out, kind of thing? Because at that point, they're covered in shit. Or playing with it, maybe. Uh-huh. The poop. I don't know. I just imagine the entire tub being filled with shit, but maybe it's just a piece of poop. I don't know. Yeah. I I don't know. I, I you know what's interesting to me is like, what if like as by extension they had a lot of fun with it in the bathtub? So they having took the brown play-doh jar, opened it up, poured it out, and then just put it in there and box that junk up for later, you know? It was a pretty good time. And then <laughs> why do you start returning to a Russian? Hey, yo, what up? I'm rushing now. God damn. <laughs> you hit the squats another, after. Another yeah, yeah, and the parents like come like, yo, kids, we're gonna put the plate out today. They just bust that junk open. It's like an effing fart bomb in the face. I'm eating stop. Well, maybe you shouldn't make that mistake on my stream. I have a question. What's so up? when you do collabs and someone and there's a raid and you want to say hi, do you just like ignore them? What do you what do you do? Have you raided? Um yeah. Oh no, just say hi, we can pause for a sec. All good, all good. Here, come here. Do, do you know, do you know Yoklesh? Who? She's really yes, hot of only. course. Um, yes, hi. I know. Every VTuber. I'm Villian, hi! Yo, thanks for reading, Lena. Um, pretty poggers, uh... Yeah. Okay. She's very sexy and she's a really good artist. You like, you like hot women, right? I love hot women! Cause I pick up hot women all the time. Yeah. Ooh. Then you will love her. She's amazing. Hi. Hi. We, we are doing a, a submitted from our communities, as you can see, yeah. uh, stories. We have a very reading. intelligent community uh, that we all are very proud of. They play with their poop in the bathtub. So that's pretty yep. sick. Uh, yeah, pretty gnarly. Mwah. Enjoy the shit stories. I hope you had a good stream. True. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and now I owe 
two subs to my chat. Next story. I think this one's you. Not mine, but my cousin at age eight elbowed a younger child in the face at a water park and the child wouldn't stop crying, so she kissed him, which made him cry even more. This is your <laughs> embarrassing story? <laughs> wait, wait, this person just found out they were gay. <laughs> Wait, what? Live on you stream. Well, cause cause he started crying more. He didn't like it, you know? Like Oh oh I oh oh yeah. oh, 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 oh. Yeah yeah, that's oh. an odd way to find out you love Kappa Pride. That's a really sick emote by the way. Holy frig. <laughs> okay, yeah. fuck it. My brain did not go there, but I, I can understand that now. True! I, I don't get it. It's just like it's like <laughs> Like, does did they even know this kid or like what? Like what happened? <laughs> yeah, it's a very it was a very like uh you know weird story, not a lot of details, but kind of didn't really go anywhere. Yeah, needs more information. Right, Final conclusion. Yeah. All right, let's see. There's poop in this story. When I was younger, I went to the pool with my family. I had to go to the bathroom. Okay, we're off to a very bad start, but I didn't know where they were, so I took a massive dump in the water. I what? <laughs> Why is there so many shit stories? There's so many stories about feces! What are you guys doing? That's another sub off my paycheck. God dang it, Chad! The third poop story. Alright, so let's see what happens. They, they leave a massive log floater in the pool, and then everyone had to get out of the water, and I just blamed it on my friend. After that, she wasn't my friend anymore. That has to be on the list of most embarrassing things to get framed for. You just got at least framing for robbery, grand larceny, arson, and three other accounts of attempted murder, as well as sabotage the United States government. And that would have been preferable to getting framed for pooping in some effing water. I, like, <laughs> I can't You're believe that. Weird. Yeah, I know, right? Damn, Chat, a lot of shit stories. get your sh together. <laughs> <laughs> Holy frick. All right. Also, another question is like, you go to a bathroom, right? And you just can't, like, you, you can't find a bathroom anywhere. There was no other option. You couldn't, like, hold it in. You couldn't, like, like, when you poop, right, you flush it down a toilet. Did you expect to flush the entire pool? Like, what was the game plan there? <laughs> Why is everything poop and fart? Because it's my community. I want more farts, bro. Hey, you want to read the story? The next one? Uh, <clears throat> I let out a massive fart in front of my crush during elementary school. Now, chat, depending on what she's into, this could be a 100% killer move. This could put her in your bed in five seconds. You never effing know. However, I'm going to assume in these circumstances, she did not reciprocate. And so this man blew his shot. That's really, really unlucky. I think farting loudly in front of your crush is a very Giga Chad kind of move, but I think in this case, maybe you should like know more about her before you let that one go. Yeah, but I, I think- I have a question. Uh-huh. If you had to pick between when you like, you know, go to the bathroom to have no smell or no sound, what would it be? Holy frick, wait. Chat, one for no sound, one, two for no smell. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna take a... God dang, this is such a massive opportunity. Are you like the tooth fairy or some junk? What is this? I, I like to call myself the shit fairy sometimes. Uh-huh, nice. Cool. That's pretty cool. I like that title. It's like almost like Tsunami. All right. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I think I'm gonna go with no smell. One time I was, an, I was on an airplane and I had like serious indigestion and it was... Awful. The person next to me, they couldn't hear anything, but... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> they were dying on the entire plane flight. <laughs> At one point, one of them shouted out loud, Who the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> and, and the Epic Airplane Service had to come up. <laughs> and they come up and calm them down. <laughs> I, I was dying! I was like, I was one far from death! I kid you not, I would have gotten kicked off that airplane. I was like, they go skydiving minus the parachute. Holy frick. That Why was an embarrassing like, story. I have used the airplane bathroom or something to like let it out. You just, it, you because, just, like, no, listen, I was in too deep. I was in too deep. If you get up to go to the bathroom after that, 
and then you come back and it stops. It's just too sus. A uh, chat. I I just tried to stop. <laughs> Oh my god. I wasn't I gonna can't. get caught in 4k like that. <laughs> I've thought about this question a lot because like, uh -huh. you never, you, sometimes there's opportunities, right? Where there's no sound, but it's like, you can't mask the smell. And if you're like the only one there, you know that everyone knows it's fucking you. <laughs> yeah. It's like, let's be real. If you hold in your toots, your fucking stomach is gonna, is gonna like fucking hurt. It's not good for you. But then if there's no smell and you're like, hang on, calm down everyone, there's no smell, trust me. Toad. But there's so much sound, uh -huh. you, you just look embarrassing either way. So I don't know if there's a win-win in that at all. But the good news, right, for me is that like, everyone hates the smell of farts, but everyone loves the sound of farts. So if nothing else, if you don't make any smell, you can use it as free content whenever you want. You tell an awful joke, you're like, you like candy, Lena? Uh, sometimes. Yeah, candy's nuts fit in your mouth, and then nobody I laughs, especially not Lena. Nice. You just, just like that, and just like that, chat, Here's type keg W right now. Get those keg W's in chat you right now. We're so good. <laughs> I don't know, your brain works like a, like a hundred billion miles per hour. We are on one topic, and then somehow you're like, bloop, these nuts. I and like I cocaine! Next question! All right, I think this one's for me. I was a toddler and was at my aunt's trailer house. Okay, so this is some trailer park gameplay. Can't wait to unpack the rest of this one. And one of the windows, for some reason, was level with my a bed. Who read the spell check on this? So I had climbed onto the bed and out the window. My mom had to come and get me after I was done crying and went back to my room. <laughs> Then I did it a second time before the room became off limits. All right. She legit said coconuts. Yo, we're, hello? You taking a little nap on me? I want better stories. Do you have an embarrassing story, Fillion? Kind of, kind of. Okay, I think I've told this one before. Uh, <laughs> this is like very similar. So I don't know what it is about children, but um... But children make a mistake and their first intention is to get upset over the fact that they made the mistake. And then their second intention is to... I am no longer a virgin. And their second intention is to just immediately commit the same mistake again. I was like this and I don't know why. Tell the pool jerker story. I... Never, 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 never. So chat, listen, this is kind of a very similar story. I was at a restaurant, right? And I had a cup in my hand, a styrofoam cup. And girl, where are you going? <laughs> I'm listening, I'm listening. I'm sorry. You're leaving I'm a whole snail trail everywhere. Holy <laughs> frick. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. So chat, we're gonna be reenacting how I asked for the collab. So the girl was like this. She was like that. And I said, yo, wanna collab? Okay. <laughs> I mean, sorry, I was actually like this. You're right. Yeah, was she was like, like that. She was like that. So, <laughs> so, okay, okay, uh, okay, okay. Actual story time. I'm listening. <laughs> How come whenever okay. two VTubers get together, it just turns into the most sus junk I've ever seen? I didn't mean to. I every didn't mean time. To. I, every time. Chat, is Lena more degenerate than me? Chat, type one if she is. I have no idea. What do you guys think? Two if she isn't. We all know I'm effing the picture of holiness. Um, I'm seeing a lot of twos. Okay, well, frig. Okay. Wait, what does two mean? <sighs> two means, um, I'm more degenerate than you are. You know what? Maybe we should compare the Cooksy clips. Chat, maybe, hey, after we're done the stories, we should go on oh, Cooksy's channel shit. and see who has worse clips. I think that's you, bro. Like, by <laughs> far. No, it's not. I guarantee it's not. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Phil, you have the most well, gorgeous you. voice. Okay, simp. All right, what were we saying? Cooksy clips. Let's go. We'll do them after this. All right. Okay. Well, hey, wait. I was I was going to say what? that when I started VTubing, I actually was pretty PG. Like I didn't really cuss, and I didn't do any lewd shit. Uh -huh. I like didn't even want people to talk about my tits, and they were pretty covered. You can't and help after, that. Like, seven, <laughs> I, I don't know, like, I I was just like, I'm gonna try not to be lewd, and then seven months later, I took my tits out, and then started to talk about bowl pouches. Did you know that you can put your bowls in your cave? You can put your bowls in your cave, what? Yeah, you can suck your bowls inside your body. Do you have bowls? Sometimes. Me too. Bro. Next story! Alright! 
<laughs> um, I think this one's with you. Okay. Uh, this story has stuck with me since I was in fifth grade. My teacher was pregnant, and as a kid, I thought pregnancies pregnant were cool. Pregnancies oh. were cool, and wanted to know more. I'm studying to be an ultrasound tech right now. Wait, I asked hold up. I got a couple comments already. First off, you spelled pregnancy correctly. Your IQ is way higher than the average Twitch viewer. Settle down. Second off, this person is about to graduate college. This has to be the oldest person watching my stream right now. This is absolutely insane. We're setting world records out here. How to be pregante. That's what I expect to read from you guys. <laughs> that's fair. I, I don't know what that's like. Did you grad? Did you did you go to college? Crayons? I asked the super pregnant lady. You Have you noticed yourself Spanish getting fatter? And I wanted to ask how big her stomach grew. She was not happy. Oh! This is understandable. So chat, when you get pregnant, all right, your stomach gets bigger rate. Does that make sense? One of you understand. Now listen up, okay? This is an honest to God mistake. You say, are you getting fatter? <laughs> to a person when she's pregante and you make a mistake, it's not prego sauce, you understand? So I think, um, two, can you visualize it please? Okay, sure. All right, pretend, um, Ooh, inflation people are gonna really enjoy this one. Chat, pretend my tits are my stomach. Ugh. Don't clip that. <laughs> Wait, can I? Here, turn, turn to the right. What? Turn to the right? Wait, you're not on camera. Oh, yeah. <gasps> no, yeah, no, camera, come back. What am I doing off camera? Turn around. Okay. Okay, no, now what? Go in front of the camera. Go in front I of am, the camera. I am. They can see me. What's happening? Closer, closer into the camera. Okay. No way. Oh, wait. Don't move. What? Wait, what's whenever, happening? Whenever Don't clip away. whatever's happening, Chad. Do not clip this. Oh. Wait, it has to be just right. Okay. What's happening? Somebody clipped that. I can't clip mods. I know, right? Wait. Uh. What? No, it didn't work. I was trying to come out of your stomach and it wasn't working. All right, anyway, Chad, I'll show you how to come out the stomach properly. All right, Lena, stand the frick up right here. Squirt in front of the camera right now. Chad, this is how Lena gives birth. <laughs> Come on! What? Get st stare at the camera. Stare, stare, stare. Perfect. All right, here we go, chat. All right, here we go. Lena was. <laughs> oh god, you've been so cursed. All right, here we go. <laughs> that one down this was so awful you literally came out of me nice job dude <laughs> chat hey, chat i came out of her that's huge okay um uh, so what was that i don't know i don't know what to say this was the most embarrassing moment of my streaming career <laughs> the new lord just dropped <laughs> holy fucking <laughs> shit Wait. It's so awful. Imagine a new viewer just arrived with this. Chat, one of you just arrived for that. What? Oh my god. I I don't want to hear any bullshit about fucking baby. She came up with the baby bit. I had I had nothing to do with it. That was all you. What you one hundred percent your fault. You're gonna tell me the effing birthing fetish that you just released upon your chat was my fault? Yep. You literally started this. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, chat, we're gonna sell our disagreements out of court. Have you ever heard of a mega pint? No, what's You're that? You're having mega fry when I'm done with you. I don't get that one. Cool. It's fun. Wait, wait. Wait, surely you know the whole Johnny Depp case, right? I do, but I don't know what that means. Wow. Mega cool, is my right? Yeah. Bro, I told you yesterday when we were setting up that half the shit that comes out of your mouth, I'm not gonna know what the fuck you're saying. You're like, haha, it will be great. And here okay, we are. wait, okay, alright, finally, I got a question for you, alright? So listen up, I'm a VTuber, right? Yeah. 
and I'm busting it down sexual style. I was making out with a chick Not to bar, mention I'm really quirked up. But the real question mouth. is, Lena, am he I goaded with the sauce? Me out and told everyone. Never went back to that bar. I can hear the smell of brain cells frying from over here. Bruh. Zoomer humor holy dies of cringe. Yeah, whatever, chat. You good? You shook? You good? Like, what's the proper response? Like, what uh, do you say to that? Probably roll on the floor and crawl like a baby again, then crawl back up inside of the person you came out of. Wait, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Ah! Ah! No! Stop! Lena, have mercy! Okay. Jesus Christ. All right. Uh, I never thought so hard. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> My chat's doing a big think right now. Okay. Remember when like, we were reading embarrassing stories? That was pretty cool. Let's uh, let's stop embarrassing ourselves and instead start embarrassing our communities, you know? That's what the stream's all yeah, about. Yeah, 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 yeah. This stream is rated R. Rated R for Ratchet. All right, next up. When I was about six years old, I shoved a marble up my bum. Okay, well, there's no poop yet, so that's not bad. I freaked out, so I took a doo-doo. Minus one! That's four stories about poop! Dread Caliber, you are literally such a god with these sound words right now. Dude! You pooped it out! Oh my god, I, you made my friend leave! What, what are these stories? What is your guys' fascination with poop? I swear to god. Yeah, we're never playing marbles on stream ever again. Chat, if your marble wins, you should not shove it up your butt. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> People leave, true. <laughs> Holy frig. All right. So this says again, when I was about six years old, I shoved a marble up my butt. I freaked out, so I pooped to save my butthole. I don't think you guys understand, right? If you shove something up your butt that is the size of a literal marble, you don't have to worry about it anymore. Just leave it in there for a few days. People put much worse up there, and it ends up just fine. <laughs> Man's lost his virginity to a marble. I mean, you can't argue with those facts. <laughs> ah, all right. Uh, any, any commentary you would like to provide for our friend here who sat on a marble? Um, I do, but I don't know how PG or not your stream is. Just effing say it. Listen, it's not accountable if it comes out of your mouth. Okay, so I, I, I got like Did a, you, was this you? In the day, this was her. No, Chat, this was uh, her. No, wait, uh -huh. back in the day, my friend uh uh got these. They're, they're called ke Kegel Kegel weights. Do you know what Kegels are? Is that like a like a Zumba fit? Yeah, Zumba Fit. Uh -huh. And you put the, they're like, the Kegels have this attachment on one, like it's a plastic attachment and two bowls go in it and there's a string so you could pull it out, right? But okay. my friend at the time didn't know you had to put it in the attachment, so they just put the balls inside. Oh. And then for the longest time, the balls were stuck and they freaked out because they didn't know how to get the balls out. Oh. Uh, because they didn't have the attachment to pull it out. So um, it seemed pretty scary. Um, that's cool. Brings a whole new meaning to Balls Deep, I guess. Hey, hey, got, 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 got him. him, got him, funny joke. <laughs> <laughs> it's so dumb. Uh, you know, chat, you may assume that women know what they're doing because they have them, but they don't. Any <laughs> other questions? <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh my this fucking god. This is so dumb. Why is this so long? What? Wait, the next one? Holy yeah. moly, it's having Beethoven. It's like the Mozart. It's like the little Shakespeare of like talking for five years. What about honesty, kindness, generosity, loyalty, and laughter? It's because like an epic Facebook mom. It's like live, laugh, love 2.0. Oh, you want me you to read one this short. one? Why? Yeah, you read a long one. Fun. The other one was short. All right, that's what she said. All right, yeah. chat, I'm about to take a long one right now. When I was about 14 or 15 years old, I went through a brony phase. It's not a face, mom. I just love jars. In my history class, we were told to make a presentation on anything we wanted. Oh, boy. Chat, what is a brony going to do at the age of 15? Let's find out. I decided to make my presentation about the differences between being acquaintances and friends. 
That's actually that's that's philosophical. What the frick? Wait, yeah, this man's five head. Yeah, at fifteen. There's no Holy way I would have made something like that at fifteen. Yeah. Did you know um when I reach um uh like age fifty, you know, I'm gonna do some really cool stuff. Good job, Fillion. No, like no, like like. But what do you think about that number? It's uh pretty big. How big is 50? I don't know, enough to fit these nuts in your no, mouth. No, 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 she wants to stream, she wants to stream. She, she streams night my stream. This is, I'm getting framed. Are you kidding me? How does it feel? Huh? Huh? How does it feel? <sighs> Chat, everyone say goodbye to Lena. Where's the button? Goodbye, wait, Lena. No, hey, wait, no, wait, fuck, wait, no. Wait. Chat, it's almost like she's still here. I really miss Lena. Hey, what's up, Lena? Oh. Wait, come back. <laughs> wait, wait, come back. Wait, I don't have enough friends for this. Wait, come back. Uh, hey. All right, there it is. Bunk, bunk. <laughs> Time for the replacement. All right, Scrappy, you're in, bro. Chat, today we're going to be a track mania collaboration with Scrappy. <laughs> Holy frick. 50 is half of 100? That's true! Lena, you're giving me trauma know. right now. You're giving me serious yeah. trauma. Yeah. Good. I, you know, old people can still have fun. Yeah, but can they have trauma? Yep. Trauma and nuts in your mouth. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm gonna read this junk. <laughs> Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so we explain the difference between friends and acquaintances. That's pretty sweet. Awkward silence. Shut up, boss. Well, time a scrappy one minute. I tried to explain the line between when you hang out with somebody and when you can truly call yourselves friends. Each slide has the characteristics you would need to be able to call yourself friends. Honesty, kindness, generosity, loyalty, laughter, and a sense of magic between you. I don't know, I don't think you understand the level of cringe I'd achieved. See, I was so naive, I actually thought I was giving them a life-changing lesson on friendship. <sighs> My man tried to break down social bonds into an effing pyramid of your effing daily nutritional needs. He's like, at the very base, you need carbohydrates, also known as honesty. And above that second level, you can achieve kindness. And at the very top of the pyramid, this is like the effing Egyptians failed to put this piece on there. It's a sense of magic between the two of you. You're like effing Mickey Mouse at Disney World, and he's like double <laughs> fist in his butt. Like, it's just like, uh, some serious magic going on between the two of you at this point. R slash oh, I'm 14 fuck, and this man. is deep. It's it's serious business right here. So you know what? Like I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I don't find the story that embarrassing because I I I kind of I thought the same things. I had my own deep philosophical 14 year old thoughts. <laughs> I was 100% serious while explaining. The entire class stared at me. I thought nobody knew. I was just explaining My Little Pony, but everyone knew. The oh, teacher fuck. knew. <laughs> Wait, so I, so this could go two ways. Is he was he trying to joke about it with My Little Pony, but he he was a brony, so he really liked it, mm -hmm. and pretty much was being a brony for his presentation, and everyone knew. So then it was embarrassing. I think the answer is whichever one is funnier. Chat, whichever one's funnier. Oh my god. There it is, right there. Whatever the story means to you, because my brain can't process that right now. Okay, next one. Oh wow, you get a long one. No way. <gasps> Fuck. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> I used to foster kittens, and now a lot of kittens, when they come in... Oh, what? I used to foster kittens. Now a lot of kittens, when they come in, have a lot of issues with parasites. That needs to be a period. I That didn't make any sense. Sorry, just for future, whoever wrote this. Uh, they come in and have a lot of issues with parasites or illnesses. However, this particular litter didn't. Their poop was... Okay. No! Minus five! Are you serious? Dude... <laughs> Okay. Every five seconds! What the frick? Okay, okay. All it's right. fine, let's okay. pull it together, Chad. Minus five dollars. Mm. Okay. The poop was god awful compared to the others. It was orange and almost looked gritty in texture. Yo, wait, the poop got gritty with it? Shay! I'm so, I'll sheesh. stop. Hey, she said, she said, sheesh, we're good, chat, we're good. We're all good. 
trying to keep up. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a, it reminds me of that TikTok where they like, they like sit the old man down at the table and you can see his brain buffering for five seconds before he like slowly lifts his arm up and he's like, <laughs> and like his soul escapes his body on his deathbed. <laughs> God, <damn> it. <laughs> okay. How does it feel like fucking, uh, how does it feel to have a boomer? Effing. A boomer? No, you're not a boomer. Cause if you were, I'd be like, okay, boomer, whatever you say, boomer, okie dokie, boomer. Yeah. Okay. Okay. She knows that TikTok. Okay. Oh, wait, right. she knows that she knows that we're good yeah. chat. <laughs> okay. Uh, since they were kittens, they also had a hard time cleaning themselves up very well. And now comes the incident. I thought I had cleaned Ooh. them while I was letting them run around on my bed. I myself was snacking on a miniature pumpkin. No! It was orange! Okay. What happened? No. Okay, alright. I guess somehow one of the kittens didn't get fully clean because I spotted some orange stuff on my thumb before I could think twice. I ripped it off thinking it was a pie. It wasn't. It wasn't. It was far from it. And no. that's when I accidentally mistook cat poop for pumpkin pie. Oh no! See, chat, not only is it embarrassing, but also she probably has parasites now and her life will be forever oh. changed. Yep. yep. Yeah. That's yep. so cool. That's really unlucky. You know, one time, guys, I was drinking a Coke Icy. You know, it's like when they when they shred the ice, they put the Coke in it. It's really tasty. Now, there was this massive horsefly in the car with me, and I kept trying to swat this junk out the way. I'm like, get this horsefly out of here. Get the frick away from me. This thing was fat. Like, it was a flying turd, basically, right? So I slapped it, and it disappeared. I had no idea where the fly went. So I kept drinking my Coke Icy. I got home. I got out the car. I legit drank, like, half of this epic thing before I decided to look into the cup. And lo and behold, this massive horsefly had crashed landed like an effing meteoroid into my coke icy that i had been drinking for the past 10 minutes and let me tell you when my soul left my body i am not exaggerating it left the entire universe it legit said hi to god on its way to the epic nether it was terrible that's uh, really fucking gross dude yeah Goddamn. yeah it was um not not my not my best experience i'm not gonna lie Lots of didn't ask moments. Chat, if you're watching this stream, you signed up for didn't ask moments. <laughs> That's the whole stream. I thought a lot of these would be worse, but they've been pretty tame. Well, pretty I tame. Well, what do you mean? Like, I confess to murdering my parents? Like, what do you want here? Like, holy frick, Moonkin, know. thank you so much. God dang. <laughs> Thank you. What the frick? All right. <laughs> whenever, whenever. Yeah, whenever we'll see. We'll see. Maybe there are more horrible ones to come in. We'll find out. All right. Next story. Oh my lord. These stories are getting longer every by the second. All right. Here we go. Here we go. So my friend invited me to the machine shop on the college campus, whenever, and he whenever, let me whenever, shape whenever, some steel in the shape of a tool made for cleaning threads with a lathe. So of course my hands got dirty and I had to clean them. He led me to the sink and we got some soap and I couldn't hide the valve to turn off the water. Find the valve. Then he clapped his hands twice, which turned on the water. Oh, it's a clap on. That's very cool. That's like almost like a strap on. And then he clapped his hands yeah, twice on the close. water. Yeah, at first I thought it was fake, but I couldn't figure out any reason this would work. I just went ahead and went to wash my hands and halfway through the water turned off. I looked at him and he just stared at me silent. So seeing he wasn't going to move, I went ahead and clapped twice like the brain dead idiot I am. He then clapped twice, but the water came on for him and I heard some metal clink and there was a step bar to turn on the sink at the bottom. <laughs> okay, hey, that's pretty genius. You got you baited! You got you baited, Holy my friend! Shit. Holy frick, you just like... And he sowed the seeds of doubt. And when this man, the water cut off halfway through the effing sink, he knew. He looked over at his friend. His friend looked at him. They made direct eye contact and sensual it was. And he said, okay, bro, if you won't clap, I'll do it. And oh lo and behold, God. nothing happened. And he had to sit there knowing that this man got hit with a D's nudge joke at point blank range at Mach 40. And there was nothing he could do about it as his friend steps upon the pedal and Ooh. Effie makes it happen. <laughs> That's brilliant. I think this is my favorite story so far. Yeah, the debate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, this was yeah. like a not, not a, not too embarrassing, but it was pretty funny. I like it. 
What's up, Elena's foot? I don't know. She's squatting out here. Yo, Elena, I can only see your arm right now. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Do you usually sit down for a lot of it? You can sit down if you want, like uh, in a no, chair. No, I'm just, I'm just, I don't know. I'm just I'm vibing. Can, I'm standing. I'm oh, standing. Yeah, okay. All right, she's standing. Okay. Yeah, she's burning more calories than she usually does. <laughs> Whoa, your face is so HDMI. That's sick. Hi. Hi. Can you blink? No. Okay. I don't want to blink. Okay. Huh. Well, you have a you have an eye on your chest that blinks on your neck. That's pretty cool. It does the blinking for me. Yeah. So I don't have to. Okay. Chat, I don't know what's happening right now. I literally did not expect this turn of events. Uh, I... Lana Lazar... More like... Get out of my lane. Help. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Wait, is it Lana Lazar or Lana Laser? Lazar. You got it the first I time. I got it the first <laughs> time! Alright, chat, we have switched sides officially. Next story! Oh my god, it's getting more dense by the second. I can't. Oh, you can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. I'm still in my water. Yoinkers. Oh, wait, pop. Yoinkers. Okay, on. Why is this so fucking long? Holy shit. Um, okay. In kindergarten, we had set a time where we can use the restroom if we wanted to. The classroom I was in had a toilet in it, so instead of using the restrooms in the hallways, the teacher would line us up to use the one in the classroom. Okay, that's really weird. Um, the only problem is that there's one toilet and about a dozen kids, so it's going to be a problem if someone really needs to go. One day, I needed to go really badly, but there were a few people in front of me, and I don't want to risk peeing in my pants. Again. Again? 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 Who sent this in again? Hello? <laughs> Alright. Oh What's the next logical thing that my four to five year old boy brain could think of? Pee on the floor. Oh, nice. Hey, I can't pee directly on the floor, that would be too obvious, so how about underneath a table? Surely no one will find out. I did my business and went back to my seat, and I tried checking on the area time to time, but I couldn't find the stain, and I didn't get into any trouble, so I guess nobody saw it. How the hell did nobody notice me? Uh, wait, so you're telling me they got away with pissing under the table? Chad, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, this person who did that, they did not get away with it. Their teacher just allowed them to escape with it. Like, do they think, like, an every woolly mammoth stalked into the room, pissed under the table, then walked out? Like, no, it was obviously one of the kids. Maybe they didn't know which kid it was, like... <laughs> like, we're gonna, like, pull them up on it, because they kind yeah. of understood. Yeah. But that sucks, though. Imagine, like, really needing to go, and you have to wait for through 12 <gasps> kids to use the restroom. True. That fucking sucks. That would suck. You know, like, how that person, they poured out the milk, they got called Tsunami? Like, if this person got caught, they'd be like the effing table tinkler or some junk. I, I could not handle that. <laughs> how many of these do we have? Um, oh, okay. All right. Oops. We have yeah, yeah, yeah. as many as we need, and we can stop whenever we want. So just let me know. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm good. Pong. All right. Uh, back when I was pretty young, about six to eight years old, acting like you ain't six to eight right now, I was riding with my mother, who left me in the car to look at some paintings. Is your mama gonna sk like a, like a, like a, like a, an artist? Is she? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine you're like, hey dad, where are you going? He's like the gas station. You're like, for what? He's like cigarettes. And then your mom's like, hey, I'm going to the art station. You're like, for what? And it's like for arts and crafts. And then they just both neither come back. Like this has to be like like into like 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 embezzling money or like con artist or something like that. What the heck? <laughs> what is she looking at? Uh, so I was sitting in my car trying to solve a puzzle that my small brain couldn't figure out. Suddenly, I had to fart. Emotional so damage. I let it rip like a Beyblade. Oh no. But it didn't turn out to just be a Beybladeable situation. As a matter of fact, I ended up pooping my pants in the car. Oh my fucking Minus god. Minus six! Holy moly. All right, I felt it slide down my leg. Ugh, oh God, and it was horrific. That's an understatement. Jesus Christ. When my mother got back to where we had to go pick up my sister from ballerina practice and when we got home, what the frick? I let that fat thing slide out of my jeans and into the hellhole it deserved to be in. Oh my god, it's like an elephant trunk just dropping a turd into the toilet. This is disgusting! I would never wear those pants again. Holy frick. Did, like, no one smell it in the car? Did they not realize that, Wait, like... that's true! 
How did no one notice in the car? Surely you would smell that in someone's pants. Jesus Christ, burn the pants. I know, right? Chad, if a spider crawls in your... Yeah, no, apparently right, not. No. If a spider crawls into your apartment, you burn the whole thing down. If you poop in your pants, you burn the whole pants down. You understand, guys? Who do not negotiate Ooh. with disgustingly uh, malformed pants. <laughs> so, yeah, Jesus this... Christ, dude. Yeah, this is a story for sure. What um, about, like, he needed to fart, right? So, he... How can you, like, need to pass gas and not realize an entire fucking, like, bowel movement is about to happen? I, that's something that I never understood. You know, Elena, you play stupid what? games, you win stupid prizes. That's all yeah, I gotta say about that one. <laughs> Fucking hell. All right, next one. Okay. Uh, you guys have some long stories. Once upon a time, when I was in kindergarten, the teacher said, please inform your parents that we will need money for class photos. Me being a decent kid told my mum, and she gave me the money. The next day, me being the shy, quiet kid couldn't find the courage to give the money. I did, however, find the courage to go to the canteen to get some fruit snacks. Paul, oh, there's a snacker right there! <laughs> Chat, one of you a snacker. Let's have him go. <laughs> the very next day, my mum dropped me off at school, and the staff asked for the money. My mum told them that she gave me the money yesterday, and they all found out I stole it when I got home and I got scolded. Then I did it again a second time. Yay. Um, alright, I'm not gonna lie, I was just staring at my chat typing one the entire time. I got like a monkey brain. What happened? Uh, fruit snacks, those happen. Fruit snacks, pretty good. What else? What else? Uh, and then they stole more fruit snacks. Oh. That's it, that's, that's kind of, the, that was the Come whole story. Come on, if this is your embarrassing story, you have to do better, guys. Get it together. We need some seriously debaucherous stories. You guys understand? The most honest Philly viewer. Yeah. We'll steal for fruit snacks. <laughs> right. I have like a really crazy embarrassing story. I don't think that I do. Feel free to share any, yeah. All right. So I was three years old. Chad, can we get a story from when you're not four years old? My gosh. Get it together, guys. What about when you're having 15 and you, you, you really, you really just do some embarrassing garbage that you cannot justify being young for? Come on now. So I was three years old. I had a goldfish and my brother forgot to feed it. So I fed the fish Doritos and killed it. <laughs> <laughs> no! I thought it was sleeping. Chat, if you ever think your fish is sleeping, it's effing dead. Alright. My mom saw it and said, Why is the water orange and why is the fish dead? <laughs> I said, I feed fishies Doritos. You know, chat... <sighs> As a small child, we are not qualified to own animals. We all learn this lesson one way or another. Some sooner than others. <laughs> have Did you all used to own like a, like, a, like a pet when you were a small kid? Yeah, I have a story actually if you'd like to hear it. Sure, yeah, I'm done. Okay, so I had a... What, what is it called? A guppy? Is it called a guppy? You know, there's like ones with the pretty no, tails or whatever. No, it's called a gul gulpy. Gulpy's nuts in your mouth. All right. Uh, yeah, and so I, I had one, and... <laughs> just continue, just continue, just continue, just cut the camera! Yeah, okay, so apparently, when you have uh, guppies, or whatever the fuck you call them, I don't remember, uh, they jump. I didn't know that they jump, so if uh -huh. you have it like, too close to a service, they can jump out of the tank, right? I didn't oh, know this. So true. I had it in a cup, because I was cleaning out its tank. And, I, and then when I looked, it wasn't in the cup anymore, or the tank, and I didn't know where it was, right? Uh -huh. So I woke up the next morning, and it was dried out on my countertop. And I was like, oh shit, it's not only dead, but it's dried, and it's stuck. So my <laughs> sister uh, came in, and she got some tissue paper, and uh -huh. she ripped it off of the counter. So it's uh -huh. got, like, the tissue paper and this dried fish head uh -huh. sticking out the paper, Oh my right? god! And then she's chasing me around the entire <laughs> house with this Christ. dried fucking fish in my face, right? And yeah. she's chasing me, and I'm screaming, and I'm crying all at the same time because I, it's fucking gross. And then I hide in the bathroom, but the bathroom has these fucking, like, doors, right? That close like this. You have to close it. Oh, and okay. It I see. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So when I closed it and I did it in, she, like, shoved the fish in between the two doors. So no! when I closed it, it was like this, and it was right in front of my fucking face. So it's no! like, it forever. I hated it. <laughs> Not only do you have the trauma of witnessing your fish become Eskimo food, but you get chased around by its holy ghost only to be prevented with this effing ghastly visage one more time before it gets flushed. Mission That's yep. we'll get him next time. It's fucking gross. That's I actual that. PTSD right there. Holy moly.
You know, Fuck you know, awesome. people can be cruel when they're young. It is what it is. Next oh, yeah, one. Back when I was in grade school, I was chilling on my school stage with my friends because I thought that was our spot. Have you guys ever had a spot, you know, like 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 behind the bleachers or like you know, like in the in the basement, you know what I'm saying? Like the spot. Someone I had a crush on was walking past the stage, so I thought I should impress her as a dumb kid. I thought jumping off the stage would be the thing that would get her attention. Yes, Chad, if you ever want to impress a girl, make sure to face plant the ground right in front of her like I just did in front of Lena. Listen, Chad, this kid was literally me. I did this today, live, and now we're having an actual story about it. All right, so I thought jumping on the stage would be the thing that gets her attention. Our school's uniforms have these tight as heck formal pants. So after I landed my jump, my pants just split in two right in front of my crush. Oh. Yes, Wait, can you can you cue the music? Like cue the effing uh do 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 like as soon as you land in front of them. Oh my god. Holy frick. Poor thing. She looked at me and I just waddled away like a dog that got caught doing something bad. Chat, imagine that! You think you're about to become a superhero, you're about to find the love of your life, and when you land, your pants split in half and she stares at you condescendingly. The only thing you have left to do is just... <laughs> it's... Yeah, I mean, chat, listen, that's that's pretty embarrassing. That's like a like Spider-Man trying to save Mary Jane or some drunk, and then just everything like ends up face planting. <laughs> Tell Lena the pool jerker story, chat. Come on, I'm not telling her the pool jerker story. Be honest with yourselves. That is that is really bad. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I wasn't muted. Wait. Uh, hi. What's the pool jerker story? That's a really good question. Who's ready for the next story? What if you're ready for the next story? Get hyped for the next story. That's not the pool jerker story. Who's ready? Who's ready? You, yeah. I think it's your turn to read. Haha, <laughs> all right, you can read now. No, no, it's your, uh, hi. Uh, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Pool jerker. pool jerker story time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tell her I don't wanna I don't wanna do it do it Omega <sighs> Okay All right fine fine chat fine fine Where's my water? <laughs> ah. All right Once upon a time in a galaxy far, far away, because this definitely never actually happened. This story is 100% fake news. For sure, chat. So, I was at my house, right? And there were a bunch of people over. There was an entire party going on. Now, I was a young, angsty idiot, right? And so I said, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to jump into the pool with a bunch of effing people in it. And I'm not going to hit a single one of them. I'm just going to cannonball. And so, as I go to jump into the pool, I... Someone just swims right underneath me. I land on their head and they start crying after someone effing just dive bombed them from above. And now you see that's not so bad. You just land on somebody, blah, 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 blah. Well, I got sent to my room, right? And you know what an angsty, hormonal, frustrated teenager does when they're by themselves? Okay. Yeah. So, I was busy, one could say. And, uh, I'm, uh, in my bed and I got the bed sheets on me and, and... I hear a knock on the door. And I'm like, hey, I'm busy right now. I'm like, oh, you know, Flynn, it's all right. We know it was an accident. You can, like, come out and I can come hang out. Blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, no, 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 no. It's, it's, it's fine. I'm really, I'm good in here right now. I'm having a great time. And they say, no, no, no. You can, you can come out, Flynn. Come out. They open the door. They walk into my room. Now, little Flynn got any pants on, like usual, or, <laughs> or nothing. And there's nothing separating me but a blanket in the way. And I'm like, okay, stop, stop. I'm good. I'm good. You can stop right there. You can stop right there. Like, no, it's okay, Phil. And they sit on the bed next to me. <laughs> Emotional damage. I don't, I'm sweating bullets at this point. I don't know what my future holds, but it might not be anything effing good. And so I say, listen, I'm good. You can head out now. I'll be down in just a little bit. And they say, okay. And they get up and they walk out the room and they leave the door open. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, you know, hopefully they had a congested nose or something like that, but... 
<laughs> that was uh, one of the most embarrassing high stakes situations I've been involved in. So, yeah. Wait, I'm not. Okay, wait, hang on. First of all. What? <laughs> Holy <laughs> frick, Drac, you paid 100 bucks for that? Jesus. <laughs> What's up? I don't get it. So, the embarrassing part was that. Wait, why didn't you have your pants on? Because I was being a frustrated, hormonal, angsty teenager. And it was embarrassing because you had no pants on, but it, the blanket was on top of you. No, because like know. when you like when when you don't have like pants on in a bed by yourself, you and you are you're hormonal and like you 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 you're doing stuff like. All right, chat. We got it to her. She chat. She figured it out. She figured it out. We're all good now. We're all good. So as it turns out, she doesn't masturbate. That's pretty cool. All right. <laughs> okay, huge. When you I said hormonal, I thought that you were crying and like throwing a fucking wobbly or something. I don't know. You fucking you cried and you're upset. So you're like, what? Yeah. Somebody well, that's how it went. Okay. Listen, you're gonna criticize me for that. No, I mean, if that's what you gotta do when you're upset, by all means, I- Okay, I didn't fucking know. I- I didn't- I had- okay, alright. Well, um, what the frick is a wobbly? A wobbly was a, like a tantrum. A tantrum? Okay. What, what is that? Is that like Australian or something? Yeah, yeah, I think some people in the UK might say it. Australia oh. and said. Okay, huge! Wow, chat, today we learned a new word. That's pretty cool. <laughs> What I just hear is my first time on your channel. Welcome to the stream, bro. It's his every day. All right, next story. I think this one's you. Or maybe it's me, actually. I think it's me. I think it's me. All right, here we go. When I was about two years old, I wasn't that tall. In fact, I was only about one and a half feet tall. Wow, Philly and IRL pop. Hello there. It just so happens that this is a very similar si height to the average toilet at the time. Our story begins with a twice spun around the sun little me enjoying some afternoon television. That was artistic. At some point while I sat enjoying my blues clues, it occurred to me that I desperately needed to poop. Minus one! How many subs? That seven? Holy moly. All right, here we go. Unfortunately, or fortunately, the bathroom was only a few feet away from my spot before the TV. So I scrambled onto my waddlers and stepped into the room of relief with all the grace and... What the fr saddled second year cut? Oh, okay, all right. Chad, they made it to the bathroom and succeeded in freeing themselves of their denim overalls in time to perform a dookie deposit. What is this language? This is like your effing average redditor typing this story of what twice spun around the sun dookie deposit. <laughs> This is so colorful. I was too short to get on the toilet on my own, but a witty little wet ears. So I did what any reasonable boy my age would have done and pooped on the bathroom rug. Yeah, this story went so far over my head. Yeah. Like, I don't, like, I... Wait, what the fuck is this a This person witty little busted meteor? out the effing Oxford Dictionary to tell me they pooped yeah. on the floor. Yeah, that was the most convoluted way of saying, yeah, I took a shit on the rug. So basically, I pooped on the floor when I was two years old. Like, <laughs> case closed. Fucking, yeah. fucking uh, next. <laughs> Whoever wrote that, I love that. Thank you. Definitely in the word requirement. I know, right? Yeah, I had this kid wrap my asses. Holy frick. Beautiful language. All right. Uh, I think it's uh, your turn. On a bright summer day, I went to a friend's house. I had a crush on her. She invited me to her band's party after a practice at her house. I was thrown into a group with a lot of people I didn't know, but I was having fun. <gasps> it was time to play in the pool. This is where things took a turn. In the pool, we decided to play Marco Polo featuring Infection. What the f- is that like a rapper? Yo, Marco Polo featuring Infection, the hottest track of 2022? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yo, it but call me hot. big. Yo, it's it's it's, it's Lil Marco featuring Big Infection. Like, <laughs> what the fuck? I didn't know how to interpret that. Yeah, me neither. I got tagged by her, and we both searched around the pool with our eyes closed. I was reaching out, and I heard someone moving nearby. I made a dive. What the? I heard my friend yell out. I felt the touch of something soft yet whenever, with a surprising whenever, whenever, firmness. Whenever, like, wow. My brain didn't process what I had touched. Ah, sorry. I casually said and went back to the game. Everyone went quiet for a bit and I was confused. Later, I realized what happened. I had accidentally leaped and touched her chest. My first thoughts were, anime is real, huh? 
If she happens to be listening, I'm so sorry. It was not intentional. Thanks for not making a big deal out of it. Chat, this didn't happen. This guy is literally just putting his effing RP story out here. I guarantee- Chat, this is not real. <laughs> whenever, whenever, whenever. Oh my god. This is the biggest Kobe I've ever seen in my life. My man took an effing scene from a slice of life anime and dubbed his own text over it. Called an effing submission. I'm hitting him with plagiarism. Minus yeah. one right now. I agree with that. This was like- I think this story would have been okay if it wasn't- Anime is real, huh? Yeah, it's true. I don't like that part. Take that part out and resubmit it. Chat, if anime was real, then women will be real. And we all know that's not true. Next story! Uh? Alright, I was probably like 12 when this happened. I was on a mini family vacation. It was scorching hot when I went to the Universal Park. I was waiting in line and midway I got a wedgie because of all the sweat. <laughs> Wow, Pog! Alright, so, uh... It wasn't a wedgie people could see, and I didn't want to fix with my hands. So I decided to try and throw it back to get it unstuck. It took me a few tries, but in the end, I got the wedgie out. Bro. <laughs> after I went on the ride, I didn't think much of it. It wasn't long after we got off the ride that my mother told me that the people right behind me in the line were staring. I unintentionally twerked for people waiting to ride a simple park <laughs> attraction. <laughs> so listen, so bad. listen, chat, you could, you could, you have two options. You either pull the wedgie or you twerk. Which one are you picking right now? Like, <laughs> she made her choice and nobody can stop her. I just... <laughs> <laughs> I think that's pretty fucking boss, man. Good on her. You know, I think that's confidence. <laughs> it's just like, the dude's like high as frick after seeing that happen. He was like sitting there like, <laughs> and then the girl in front of me started twerking, man. <laughs> Hottest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> I don't even know what happened. I thought about asking to be my girlfriend, but uh, frick. <laughs> we got married, and then we had kids, and that's our story of how we fucking met. Yeah, how I met your mother. This was her. And then went on an oh amusement park ride together. <laughs> I want to do that. <laughs> the most casual twerk in history. Okay. Oh, frick. Look out. You're discombobulating. <laughs> pretty good, I think. Yeah, it was good. Holy frick. All right. This is a beautiful story. I, I, you, <laughs> even yeah, worse, this was a guy. Listen, chat. Men can twerk, all right? Men have rights. <laughs> what happened to that? My hair is like in the air now. It just like... I didn't like my twerking. Oh, what the frick? <laughs> Whoa! What the fuck? It's like a paintbrush. It's just stalking your position. What the frick? Wait, can you like, can you like back up? I want to see if it's just like in front of your head. <laughs> Wait, can you duck down too? I want to see like go straight up. The static electricity be kind of crazy. Yeah! <laughs> nice. I don't know what to do oh, with this, fuck. but there's a lot of potential. It's like a like a worm flying behind your head. Oh, oh, wait! Stop! Stop! Wait! Ah! Uh, uh, hi, Ch Chat. I don't know what's happening right now. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, Lena. Listen, we can do that after the stream. Please have mercy. <laughs> uh. Okay. Fuck! I love your chat. All right. Anyway, bro, you got Looks actual like anime girl physics IRL right now. Really? Oh, you gotta swap avatars, looks like. That's busted, busted. Oh god, oh man, right. oh god. Don't look at me, don't look at me. Alright, while you do that, I'm gonna read the next one. So, okay. I walked in- Oh, frick. Camila, thank you so much for the raid! What's up, friends? Hello! Yo, what's up, Camila? I've had a great stream. Thanks for the raid. Chat, the person that I raided raided me back. That's how stonks work. That's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, chat, go check out Camila. She's pogged. Alright. Uh, thanks so much for the raid, sis. So I walked in on my friend and his girlfriend doing stuff at his house. I was supposed to be at his house an hour before, um, for band practice, but I had to run some errands. Anyway, I hear what's going on in the other room, and I have an idea. I decided to grab my guitar. <laughs> Okay, okay, Wait, places. this is the biggest troll in history. These people are banging in the effing hotel floor. And this man's like, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna grab my effing metal guitar and start blasting through the fire and the flames by Dragon Force. Holy giga, Chad. After I do that, I hear the girl yell, What was that? And then she storms out and tells me to leave. Was funny, but I lost her friend, lol. What? I, I don't know, Dude. man. 
Y That's a badass friend. If I was doing it and they started playing a guitar, I'd be like, fucking rad. Yeah. And that girl can get the fuck out. <laughs> I think he clunked his friend though, TVH. But hey, it's all right. Jesus Christ. That's such a giga chat move. You're like, oh, dang. They're having a good time. Time to enhance their experience. Like, imagine chat. You're just having, like, you know, normal, like, I want to ERP with you tonight. And then suddenly the music just turns into, like, doom, rip, and tear, thrash metal. And like, <laughs> like, can you imagine the energy that would be in the room at that moment? Unstoppable. I think that's fucking rad. Yeah. I, dude, if she can't handle it, then I would never, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't enjoy banging her. Couldn't they bang it any other given time? Just True. that one time there was amazing serenade music. Like, just. Yeah. I would have liked it. If someone's blasted the fire and flames chat, it's not a troll, it's a serenade. Just work with it. <laughs> All right, next one. Oh my god, what is this? Chat, this is a product of Zoomerism. We have to stop Zoomers. <laughs> All right, it's your turn to read. Let's get it. I'm going to the next one. Okay, never mind. Chat, I'll read it. I lost my morbidity. All right, I'm not reading that. Okay. <laughs> oh my Jesus. Oh my God, you signed up for this. Nice, let's go. Wait, why is it going backward? Oh. Uh. Wait. What? Hold on, it's going backwards. One second. Huge. Chat, it's going backwards like the rivers. After an earthquake. Okay. Wait. Oh, I was nine or ten at the time. True. I returned home from school. My parents weren't home and I had no key for the house. Five minutes later, my little brother arrived. Both of us just waiting outside. Uh -huh. A neighbor saw us. She told her parents, we'll arrive later. Uh, they informed her about it and suggested we should stay at her place until they arrive. Okay. She was a very kind neighbor, so she prepared food for us, and we all sat down at the table together with her kid, who was about my age, and her newborn baby. Okay. So everyone starts to eat, and then our neighbor in front of everyone breastfeeds the baby. Oh, okay. Chad, did you know breastfeeding isn't illegal on Twitch? Oh, I didn't know that. You want to demonstrate? True? No, 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 wait. <laughs> It's not. It actually is not illegal on Twitch. All right. So this person starts breastfeeding a baby live on a uh, stream, uh, and then what happens? So everyone starts to eat, and then okay, wait. Well, yeah, I took a glance. Me and my brother exchanged glances, telepathically agreeing this is weird, it's true, and that we shouldn't look at her. Next, I'm looking at her embarrassed son, and we just sent her a state of complete silence. <laughs> I locked my neck in position and fixated my eyes onto the plates to avoid being rude because I just couldn't stop looking. This went on for about 15 minutes, and due to the silence, we could all hear the baby making sucking noises from time to time while eating. That was one of the most awkward moments I had to deal with as a kid. Um... Yeah, that's- that's gotta be up there. Now, chat, listen, I get it, I get it, you know, it's a natural process. However, there are times to do that, and there are times to not do that. If you're sitting at the table with a bunch of nine-year-old children, I mean, that might not be the play to do it. Now, if you're chilling by yourself in your room, that might be the play to do it. Now, if you're at an amusement park, that's probably not the play to do it. Now, if you're streaming on Twitch.television, then that is absolutely the play to do it if you want to be a ladder climber. So, I mean, there's a lot of yeses and nos about the situation. I'm going to have to put this one in the no category, if I'm honest with you. Uh, very odd. <laughs> very, very odd. I'm neutral. Neutral? Uh, I like titties and babies gotta eat when they gotta eat, so... I don't know, on, this, on the flip side of that, man... It's like, what- just not to- you know, just saying, what if the parents didn't teach the kids that fucking titties are great? There's nothing to be weirded about, you know? Fucking titties anywhere, at any point in time. You know okay. what I mean? Yeah, you know, that's fine, like, uh, maybe if society didn't ostracize men to not, like, look at titties so much in public, then maybe this would be totally okay. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. Holy frick. All right, next. So when I was in college, I had a crush on a girl in one of my classes. That's crazy. Wait, this is in college. Wow. Chat, we got someone in college right now. Wait, this has to be the oldest snacker we've seen so far. That's crazy. All my friends were psyching me up. Uh, after a painfully long time talking uh, to her about literally everything except asking her out, I finally did it, and chat, she said yes. All right, listen oh, up. Shit. This story is fake. This man got a girlfriend. I was excited but played it cool and got her number. We started texting to set up a date. Then the next day, she texted me and canceled. All right, chat, this story is actually real. I lied. Holy because of that. <laughs> 
<laughs> because another guy asked her out, and in other words, she would rather go out with him. Okay, well. Oh well, well, well. my god, the actual heart wrenching destruction that that was. Holy frig. Oh, chat, look, that was it's. Forever. Chat. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it's Lakari! That's crazy! Alright. I was kind of crushed. Get it? Because he has a crush. Haha. <laughs> uh -huh. But I'm pretty good at handling rejection. Chat, this man's got experience. And he's not afraid to admit it. Which is good because another completely different girl went on to do almost the exact same thing. Dude, this is like a super villain origin story right here. This is the reason... This is the reason he's an effing misogynist. <laughs> <laughs> my my 18 reasons why um let's I see wonder, like mm -hmm. i want to know I, like uh, there must be a reason why back to back two chicks were like you know what fucking never mind i, I maybe i you know i Ooh. can't blame anyone but you know that's that's two in a row what's up with that <sighs> i don't know like maybe like you just had a dream twice in a row <laughs> like, uh, uh, pretty extenuating circumstances the only difference the second time was that the girl called to tell me she was canceling for another guy. What can you do but laugh and move on? Holy frick. Chat, this man takes it is what it is to heart and runs with it. This man lives and dies by that rule. <laughs> I think it's a it crazy is what it is. It. Yeah. Chat, why go to therapy and pay thousands of dollars and millions of hours when you can just say it is what it is? It's completely free. <laughs> do not take this as advice. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. Hi, we're reading embarrassing stories from our communities. Hi, who wants to get embarrassed? Secondhand cringe. Let's get it. Feeling is taller. Am I taller than you? Okay, no, stop. Stop. Okay. Chat, I'm taller than her. The camera angles, man. It's just Hollywood movie magic. Uh, uh hi. <laughs> uh, she told me to be shorter so that she didn't seem <laughs> short. <laughs> Don't tell them that! Please don't accept. Never said, she never said that. I never said that. Just like we never collabed while she was getting twerked on. Okay. Yep. Uh, next one. <laughs> so I was pretty young when this took place. Still a kid, and I had developed a sudden interest in learning about all different animals. Furry confirmed. I absolutely love to read from an early age, so I went through every book and picture guide I could get my little hands on. Yo, that's my rapper name, Little Hands. Little hands. <laughs> little hands, little hands, little hands. We got little Zan, we got little hands. Uh, one day, I stumbled across a guide on the octopus, and I was so amazed at what I read about them. Did you know they have their testicles on their head? When I reached the end of their entry, I jumped up and ran into my mother's kitchen. Okay. Uh, where she was entertaining a few neighbors as guests for a little dinner party. In my excitement, I rushed up to my mother in front of everyone at the table, grabbed her shirt sleeve, and yelled loudly, Mom! Mom, I just learned an octopus has eight testicles! Bruh. Ha! <laughs> timing! That's really uh, cute. That's I adorable. Story. I need to know what happened after they did that, though. Like, what was the <clears throat> response? Also, wait, can we back up a second? Rewind. Uh -huh. uh, I don't think octopuses have balls on their heads. Wait, they don't? Chat, one of the octopuses, the octopuses, the octopuses are on their head. The octopus? No. no? They no, definitely no. are. No idea. Mods, look it up. Mods, mods, mods. Figure it out for me right now. No question mark. They do! They do! <laughs> Their head is a ball, true. Uh, I Listen, I guarantee you, I am actually uh, a, uh, a wildlife uh, surveyor. I actually read Animal Planet one time. What's happening? Are you listening to me? Fucking bop. Yeah, now I'm listening. What's up? What's happening? You, are you vibing to the music right now? Mm-hmm. Do you want to do like a dance break? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to? Oh, heck yeah. yeah. Wait, plug! Okay, what song do you want to listen to? What do you listen to right now? Whatever you want. Send it to me. We'll put it We'll play it at the same time. Oh, heck yeah. Uh, do you care about DMCA? No. I don't. Cool. Thanks, Twitch.television. Um, let me see. Chat, what song are we gonna dance to? We have an opportunity for both Lana and I to do a dance break right now. <laughs> What's it gonna be, chat? Send in your questions right now, Vod Fogs. I know, rest in peace, dude. You remind me, let's do it. Hmm. <sighs> Crab Rave, Weezer, F it, Caramel Dance, and never gonna give you up. Do Fortnite dances. We already did that. <laughs> hey, you. Uh, Crossing Fields. 
Uh, Weezer? Why does everyone want Weezer? Yo, Wheezy, baby. Um, Edamami? Ooh. What kind of music do you like listening to? Uh, depends on the mood. Anything, really. Cool. I'm easy. Lena dancing greater than Phil dancing. My own moderator. Very cool. Um, I'll get intro full blast. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you wanna do you wanna dance to the all yay intro song? Let's go. Let's I love do that. Let's do it. <laughs> whenever, whenever, All one. yay intro song. You the best. Full intro music, ten hours. Alright, bet. Or I'll send this to you. <laughs> Have a little bit of fun with this guy, cannot lie. Please. Oh, uh, yeah, this is it right there. This is the music. All right, Lynn. <laughs> I sent you the YouTube ready. video. Okay, we're gonna start the YouTube video on three when you're ready. Okay, hang on, hang all on. Right, all right, all right. Are okay. you good to go? Okay, okay. All right, here we count? go. Okay, uh, are you ready for the countdown? Yep, ready. Okay, so we're gonna go on go. Three, two, okay. one, go! Have a little bit of fun with this guy, cannot lie. Oh man, this guy is so screwed. Alright, here we go. What's that? <laughs> ah! right Are you ready? You ready? You ready? Oh ready. I hang in love Fortnite. Yo, 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 yo. This is actually such a bomb. Huh. I thought it was gonna be like so editable into like a YouTube video or something in the future. <laughs> Soma, 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 Soma. Pum, 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 pum. Uh, pum, 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 pum. All right, we're gonna go hard. We're gonna make this show happen. Oh, okay. All right, we're gonna drop it on three. I expect the craziest junk out of you. We're gonna effing lose our marbles live on stream. I'm gonna see pose. Ah. Let's get it! Yo, 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 yo! Let's send it! Yeah, 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 <laughs> All right, GG. That's great. I'm pausing it. <sighs> I'm just leaving holding my hand and it's fine. Cool. Oh, I found myself. You good? Oh. Yeah, that's... Oh. That was oh. fun. Alright, chat, she's gonna be recovering for the next 10 years, so it's fine. Left her hanging, true. This is literally the mind of a kid with ADHD. Alright, chat, don't make fun of YouTubers that much. You can roast me, but you can't roast Lena. <laughs> My hair is stuck! The classic! My hair is gonna be stuck for the next 10 minutes. Alright. I did it. Whenever, Yo, whenever, whenever. Look at this class. fucking bullshit. What oh, the fuck? Do a flip? Do a flip! Alright. Lana's meditating. I know. She's literally a Jedi. She's the airbender? True. 
done. Can you like do a flip and then like land on your one knee and then propose to me? <laughs> I accept. Okay. <sighs> Let me come over here. All right, now I need a, I need enough room for it. I'm spacing it out. I'm spacing out like a lot. Oh, oh, you gotta stay still. What do you want to do? Like right here? Right here. All right. Cool. All right. Oh, frick, I need to put on my chin strap or I was gonna end badly. All right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. One, two, three. Lena, will you marry me? Yeah, of course I cool. would. Cool, I gotta go call someone. Oh. What? I gotta go. What? Oh, okay. Be good. <laughs> hey, what do you mean? I'm just hanging out. What's up? <laughs> I know, I Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, beautiful. Yo, my sandwiches. My sandwiches. People are killing it today. Holy moly. Hey. You, you, uh... What? Nothing. I, this is exactly what I wanted. You wanna touch uh, my bush? My life. Stop, stop, stop! I'm a virgin! Help! <laughs> no touch, bad touch. <laughs> Holy frick. All right, Pog. Oh. All right, you wanna get through a few more stories? Sure, let's do it. I gotta fucking move this, so hold on one sec. All right, bet, 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 bet. Very clippable stream, not gonna lie. Oh, chat, look, we're looking so submissive and clippable today. That's pretty fun. <laughs> Wait, did you move the camera? Oh, no. No, 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 I moved the, the slides. Okay, cool. I, I oh, just, oops. I'm curious, by the way, do you have like a license for this or? A license for what? That commercial dump truck you got in the back. <laughs> Wait, where'd you go? No, Lena, don't jump! Lena! Chad, she just jumped off the cliff. Uh, <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. She's back. She respawned. It's okay. Listen, they don't call her Lena Nine Lives for nothing, and they don't call me Philly Nine Inches for nothing. <laughs> All right, what's up? Hey, man. Hey. Okay, we're you gonna ready, continue. Ready yeah, yeah, we're gonna continue with the stream. Um. All right. So. Oh, ah! It's your turn to read. All right, prove to people your oh. your reading level is above that of a fifth grader. Let's make it happen. Right. As a kid, I had a nightmare and I went to my parents' room and caught them having sex and I asked what they were doing. They actually fucking told me. The end. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow! What a story! Oh. Can I get some effing uh. giga chats right there? Holy frick. It reminds me of that goofy thing. It's like... Gosh! Uh, wait, what, what is Goofy's son's name? Frick, I don't even remember anymore. Dude, I don't know, but I know who you're talking about, but is I don't it? know his fucking name. Gosh. What's his name? <laughs> Your dad doesn't have Damn. sex. He fuck. <laughs> Max? Yeah, it reminds Max. me of that stupid meme. Ma Ma Max. Yeah, exactly. Ooh. Yeah, they call me Philly Nine Inches because I'm nine inches under the legal midget line. <laughs> We're freaking now, get over it. We're manufacturing your new sister. Yeah, chat, look, they're just developing the new DLC. It's fine. <laughs> Holy freak. Chat, I mean, come on. Who hasn't walked in on their parents when they're a small kid? I haven't did that. Chat, I, I, I walked into my parents when they were doing that junk, and I, I asked them, I said, hey, is, is, is Jesus with an apostrophe S when you say Jesus is, or is it just Jesus with, with just the apostrophe? They answered my English question, and then I left the room. <laughs> and I never realized until years later what they were doing. They're like, oh yeah, I, I think it's Jesus without the S at the end. <laughs> what the fuck? How yeah. did you end up realizing later that they had sex? Uh, because I remember the fact that she answered me while she was sitting on top. Uh, so, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> this is so embarrassing! <laughs> she was sitting on a 
the chair. It's fine. Listen. Uh, <laughs> Holy frick. Thought my mom's toys were bag massagers as a kid. Hi, Groovy. Thanks for the raid. Welcome. This is Philian. Holy frick. Hi, I'm Philian. Phil she am. walked in on her, her parents having sex. Okay. No, that's not the introduction we're making right now. It was a very hard time for me. All right. Hard time for more than one person. <laughs> Mods! Ban Lena! <laughs> Best intro ever. Come back here, you goblin. <laughs> yeah, goblin is nuts. Okay. Uh, let's continue. What bam? Father, forgive me for I have sinned. This dude's an entire confessional RP. Listen, chat, call me a Catholic priest because I want to get introduced to your small child. Uh, when I have sinned, when I was traveling to Chicago, I went into the bathroom for a quick piss. And there's a man taking the fattest dump. Minus one! Wow, that's eight subs right now. Eight effing subs right now. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Taking the fattest dump conceivable. I generally felt bad for the guy, but on the way out, I turned the lights off. I just walked off and didn't think about it. <laughs> it wasn't until I was on the airplane that I realized what I had condemned that man to. <laughs> she turned that man into a bane, dude. He's gonna walk out the bathroom in like 30 minutes. He's gonna be like, I was born in the darkness, molded by it. You really turned off the lights. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy frick. Yeah, I don't know. Pretty spectacular. <laughs> so many poop stories. Also, excuse my dog sound in the background. Just, just fucking ignore it's it. Okay, I can't hear it. Okay, great. Awesome, great. Uh, yeah. I feel like I had another question. I'm deaf and um, dumb, but like, I think literally just dumb. Why did someone just ask if I'm muted? Uh, I'm not, you're getting- you're getting one guy in. Fuck off! What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> do, you have, do you have 11 point tracking? Or do you have just regular like- No, I got the three. I don't know what the point of 11 point is. It's just really uncomfortable and expensive and... Like, if you move around a lot, everything's gonna slip anyway. So... Someone asked why your tracking was better, and I was like, I don't, I don't know. Well, maybe you're, you're, they're. Do you have eleven model. point tracking right now? I just, uh, well, I don't have it on now, but oh. I just bought it recently. But no, oh, I, I just see. have the regular shit. Yeah, you can yeah. Just do my model. Um, my model's probably better just put together. Maybe it was made by a Korean guy. That's definitely Who's it. There you go. Yeah. Trying to absolve. He gave it a bad that. bullet. Whose kid are you trying to absolve of sin? I have no idea what that means. All right, next story. Your turn. I once went to the <laughs> dentist uh -huh. and mistook the dentist's finger for a suction straw thing and sucked on his finger and we didn't talk for the rest of the appointment. <laughs> I feel like I've heard that story a lot. Like, I, I, I can never imagine oh sucking God. on their finger. Ain't no way. Uh. Ain't no way. Are you serious? It's hilariously believable. This is the most awkward of awkward situations. <gasps> yeah. Hmm. Hey, hey, chat, have you ever been to the dentist before? And it's just like, oh, it, the dentist lady is always some big titty woman. And as she's like brushing your teeth, you can feel her chest on the back of your head. Ha, does, is that relatable to anyone else? No. That no. happened to me so much. Come on, chat, that happens to you guys. It, chat, it happens. Of course it does. It is the most comforting thing. Really, uh, like, uh, it's not even like, oh man, smaller. this is so dirty. It feels comforting, you know? No, my dentist was an old lady. I mean, you can still have big chest. I don't like... <laughs> so comfy. It is comforting. Wow, what is that? Wait, what the frick is that? Ah! Oh! <laughs> I was just testing it out. She's testing it out that. with her chesticles. Very yeah. cool. All right. <laughs> Spits out tooth. What's a dentist? Yeah, man, me too. You're so lucky, Phillian. I want that. Chat. You gotta ban your coomers, what the frick? <laughs> I don't know if I have- do I have coomers? I don't know. I, apparently you got one of them. I'm kidding, Reyna, I'm just taking out of context. That's Reyna's not mine. good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I have yellow teeth. Very cool, Lord Starscream. He loves Transformers, me too, man. Alright, next story. Ooh, you got a long one. Wait, this one's mine? Yeah. Wait. No. Oh. Never mind. I got it. Okay. All right. When I was around 12 or 13 years old, one of the biggest video games at the time was the original Tomb Raider, and I absolutely loved it. 
One day I had read on the internet about a supposed cheat code that made Laura nude. Chat, this is the early days of the internet. There were cheat codes to make everybody nude except none of them exist. Why do they not exist? Because people don't want to get banned from making video games. That's crazy! So, as it turns out, that wasn't true. Um... Me being a young boy who was just starting to notice girls was naturally interested in this. Wow, for research. During this time, I was talking to a friend who was also playing Tomb Raider about this cheat code. We went on about it for hours one day and how neither of us could Overwatch get it to work and what we might be doing wrong. We were so engrossed in that conversation that I stopped paying attention to who else might be in the room at the time. Big mistake. Because at some point I looked back and saw my father was standing there waiting to pick me up. He had been sitting there silently waiting for me and had listened to our conversation on how to unlock quote unquote nude raider. Needless to say, I was embarrassed and didn't say anything on the way back, and neither did he. For those wondering though, there is no cheat code. <sighs> Can you blame him? Can you really blame him? Mission failed. Come we'll on. Chat, listen, Tomb Raider was a really high level game at the time. Laura Croft, or the frick her name is, she probably had like effing seven polygons. Literally an insurmountable number. Can you imagine how many pixels that would be in modern day currency? I miss the old Laura Croft, man. I wish oh. the old Laura Croft was like in current gen mm -hmm. and she just had like the nicest looking titties Ooh. you've ever Whenever. seen. And she like Whenever fought off time. dinosaurs and climbed rocks and like found crazy shit in tombs. <laughs> you know? I miss her. Yeah, all right. <laughs> like, it's like people really down bad for like five pixels back then. Just shows you how far humanity has come. Get it? All right. Oh, dude. What? Did you. Okay, uh, yep, that was actually really quick. I kind of caught it, but a little bit too late. Did you ever play a Tomb Raider at any point in time? No. Okay, so in Tomb Raider, mostly like one through four or some shit, mm -hmm. uh, before you play the game, there's an option in the game that you can go into her house and run around and do flips and crazy shit. Mm -hmm. um, so I think it was in Tomb Raider 2, can't fucking remember. But she has this butler, right? This little butler. Uh -huh. He looks like this. He's carrying this tray. He's really Does fucking he talk old. Like, tray. <laughs> That's the voice it's, I gave uh, him. Close. Uh huh. Close, right? So and he's got this tray and it like rattles with the teacups, right? And but every now and again, he'll like fart and go, huh! <laughs> and that's his entire like commentary, right? But the thing about this oh, is that this friend. dude, he fucking he he would follow you the entire. I don't know why the devs did this, but he would follow you through the entire house, right? So you're going to the bathroom, meat locker, the attic, and he's just like, you're like the you can hear the teacups, and he's just like, huh! <laughs> and he's just the whole fucking way, dude. That guy scared the shit out of me when I played that. I hated that. It sounded like he was scaring the poop out of himself, TVH. Like what the heck? <laughs> he just walks around farting. Is that the gameplay? Nice. That's pretty much like the whole house gameplay. Yeah, man. It's All right. Weird. Nice. Sick. Okay. Well, you know, early 2000 video games, they really had different. Not going to lie. Uh, Dixon, really thank you so much for the subs. I really appreciate that. Thank you. All right. Da, 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 da. You could lock the butler in a freezer. <laughs> what the frick? That is, that's true. That's true. It was a whole- it was a whole thing. Big boy, big boy. Alright, you're done! Okay. Uh, junior year of high school, we had a big English project that would take us most of the year to complete. And it was worth around 30% of our overall grade. Bro, you had a project yeah. that took an entire year worth 30%? I don't know if you realize this, but if you go to school for a semester, that's not a full year and it is 100% of your grade. What are we talking about? <laughs> Part one of three?! Wait, a whole, okay, you can- Congratulations! Okay, I can't wait for you to read all this! Thank you so much for volunteering! Let's effing get it! We're reading an effing light novel. This is like Fifty Shades of Grey, except like, Embarrassing Story Edition. Alright, let's continue! Okay, it involved a book report and a presentation to the class. Whenever, we had a whenever, list of books whenever, to pick whenever. from, and with little information other than the title and author. I ended up going with Ulysses, Ulysses by James Joyce, hoping it would be about the Civil War. Spoiler alert, it had nothing to do with the Civil War. No. Holy shit. I knew I was in trouble. I knew I was in trouble before finishing the first chapter. The book was a dense 700 page behemoth with Ooh. shifting narrative styles far beyond the comprehension of the average snack. Are you flaming my viewers right now, Lena? Yes. Chat, she's flaming you guys! What the frick? 
All right, continue. It was also shockingly dirty. Turns out Ulysses is actually about a guy named Leopold who is a cuck. Okay. okay. Uh, we follow him throughout this his day as he tries to avoid going home while his wife is getting down and dirty with another guy. Okay, but this is taking a turn. Don't feel, don't feel too bad for him. Pretty much everything he does in the book is smacker levels of degenerate, including but not limited to. Let's find out. Holy frick, it's a PowerPoint presentation. What does Leopold do besides getting cucked? Visiting a brothel. Okay. Fapping on the beach in public. Wait, hold up. This yep. man is fapping in public right now on the beach. Listen, chat, I know nude beaches exist, but this is taking a little bit extreme, all right? I don't know about this part. Listen, you call me the pool jerker. This guy's the effing beach fapper. He's, out, he's got a plus one on me for sure. <laughs> Giga Chad. That's a crazy story. All right. Um, where the fuck is the embarrassing part coming in? I don't know. Fantasizes about getting spanked, gets caught lusting after a thick statue of Venus, fantasizing about watching his wife and her lover through a keyhole, fantasizes of cross-dressing and explicit sexual acts. Somehow this is considered one of the greatest books of all time. Okay. Holy shit. Okay. <clears throat> So as a teenager, I had to do a 16-page report and even worse, a 10-minute presentation with Q&A in front of my whole class about a book that I barely understood and which contained more obscenities than a Cooksey video. <laughs> oh. Hey! He's got jokes! He's got jokes right there. Huge! Just imagine standing in front of a room of 17-year-old kids trying to explain that the underlying themes of a book like that. I honestly can't remember many details from the presentation other than I was done... Other than when I was done, a girl in the front of the class raised her hand and asked me what a cuckold was. Chat! This man wrote an entire essay about people getting cucked only for the punchline to be someone asking what a cuck is. I think this is Lena from a few years ago. She stood up in front of the class and said, what's a cuck? And after my entire presentation, that's all I could do. Lena, this person got cucked. They had one on the beach and fapped. They visited a brothel. They cross-dressed. Any questions? Wahoo. What's up? What's a what's a cuckold? What's a what's a fat what's fapping? No further questions, Your Honor. <laughs> it's like it's like all right, man. God dang. Read the parenthesis. All right. If all of that wasn't embarrassing enough, I found out that my teacher kept a report as an example to show future classes. And to this day, there's still a manifest physical manifestation of that cringe being passed on to the next generation. Oh my fucking god, you uh, poor thing! No. Yeah, so uh -huh. anyway, this kid came up and started talking about cucks for 10 minutes. So listen, this is what you don't do when you're trying to make a presentation. <laughs> That's so bad, dude. Immortalized cringed, yeah. Yo, have you guys heard of Diablo Immortal? <laughs> we have cringe immortal right here. Sick game. Alright. Alright, you wanna do a few more? How you feeling right now? I'm feeling pretty good, how are you? Oh, okay, cool. All right, gray out here. One time I was camping at EDC Electric Daisy Carnival with my friends a couple years ago. It was a huge festival and the campground was massive and a lot of people were all hanging out, getting drunk and listening to music. Chat, they were not just getting drunk and listening to music. If you've ever gone to a festival, especially in one with the effing word electronic in it, you already know they were zooted out of their minds. There was fried chicken legs on the floor, needles going left and right, and people were on literal different plants of the solar system at this point. But hey, that's fine. We'll walk past all of that and continue. They were just drinking. It's fine. The 10 spots are pretty expensive, so you need a group if you wanted to camp there. Well, one day my friends and I were drinking and getting ready to go to the festival and just having a good time. At some point, a girl came from another group and started chatting with me. We hit it off pretty well, joking between each other, having a great time. Later on, she hints to me, hey, I have a tent all by myself. Want to join? Chat! This is setting up alarm bells immediately. My man is in. My man is in. How is he going to F this one up? Let's find out. Dun, dun, dun. With me being denser than a black hole, I responded, wow, that's super cool. Ha! Ah! <laughs> hey, you want to come join me in my tent? Holy frick, bad chest. I love tents. That's sick. All right, so, uh... I'm confused, but keep going. Yeah, so, okay, so he doesn't realize that she's trying to smash. Uh, you know, he thinks she's just playing Smash Bros out oh, here. Oh, Yeah! I see. All right, okay. chat, Lane is on the same story now. We're good. This is like the, uh, the chat audience perspective right here. 
<laughs> All right. Um. So after she started walking off awkwardly, yikes. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't until way later and a few friends questioning my life choices that I realized what I had said. Was she hinting at something else? Was she going to shank me and hide the body? The world may never know. Though I don't know if it's as bad as the one year of my life where I threatened people online with I'll toss your salad without realizing what it meant. <laughs> you know, chat. You know, <laughs> You know, Chad, early 2000s insults, they were a different kind of breed, you know? They're like, I will bang your mom.com, you know? Like, they're like all of the weirdest junk, and you can't even say have those insults anymore, or else you're gonna cancel on Twitch.television, right? But back then, there was no internet, so people didn't really know what the frick they were saying when they said a lot of these words, right? It's understandable. So my man Gray out went and told people, I'll toss your salad when the effing dropkick shot him in effing Call of Duty for an entire year. <laughs> <laughs> Which, to be fair, is a pretty effective form of, like, annoying somebody, right? I'm curious about the... Is she already, like, is this, like, they were talking like this? She asked, like, hey, I have a temp by myself. And he's like, oh, wow, cool. And she literally was like... I mean, like, why wouldn't you be? <laughs> you're like... I don't see anything you literally, that. you're just, like, in your mind, you're like, hey, baby, wanna smash? And he's like, yeah, I'd love to smash bros. Well, like, the video game. And then, like, what are you gonna do? You're just gonna be like... No, I would honestly change it around be like, Hey, no, like, do you wanna fuck? Oh, okay. See, chat, everybody's got their own style. Write it down. If you don't get the hint from Lena, she'll effing drill it into your skull. Maybe literally. Yeah. <laughs> That's 100% my, my style. I'm pretty, pretty, pretty... So anyway, I'm trying to smash. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, absolute Giga Chat gameplay right there. Oh, they bring base. I know, right? I know, right? I want to smash you, bro. True. I had a friend at a party. He was so effing drunk, and this girl was trying to smash. Now my friend is very intelligent, so he was effing articulating to her about effing like black holes and stuff. So he's like, "Did you know actually in the black hole, like time kind of like draws to like a standstill, and you can kind of think of like time space at this point as like a line." Uh, where where distance and time are like inverted, and then the girl is just staring at him like, "Ha, huh, that's pretty hot." <laughs> you know what else is really hot? And he's like, "What?" And she's like, "Ha ha, my uh, whatever." Like, <laughs> you know? And he's like, "He's like, oh, that's a really good point." You know, the sun is actually really hot. It's over twenty thousand degrees Celsius. No. Like, it no, was it was the man. worst dog I've ever seen. <laughs> and he, he couldn't get the hint because he was too effing drunk. I heck of love space. I know, right? Yeah. Oh my god. Poor thing. Could have just fucking, you yeah, know, whenever, if you just... Whenever, whenever, whenever. Just... Yeah, I know. Hey, trying his best. The girl is feeling all along. Listen, chat, I love space, but so does he. Probably more than I do at this point. Uh, Chief Childs, thank you so much for the subs. Holy moly. Get some giga ch giga chats in chat. Thank you so much. Thank you. What the frig? All right. <laughs> um. Okay. Next slide, I suppose. Oh my God. Holy frick. Is this you or me? Whenever, it's me, right? Whenever, whenever, Paul, I think it's you. Okay. Whatever. Space Can toil out of my face. <laughs> I wouldn't effing know. All right. Let's get it. Around fifth grade, I had a track and field competition against eight other schools. I was also in the middle of my period at the time. It was being held at a different school, and shortly after arriving, I forgot to wear a pad. Uh-oh. This is the worst. So I went to the bathroom and used toilet paper as a substitute. Classic! Totally a good idea at an effing track meet. My turn soon came to run the 400 meters, and I was literally playing the TP would work. This is not gonna work out. After the buzzer sounds, I start running and everything is going great. Around 200 meters, I feel something start dripping down my legs, but I ignore oh. it, thinking it's a loose string from my very white shorts. I reach the end and I hear this girl's giggling behind me. I think it's about something else, but I look down and see I'm covered in blood from my shorts down to my shoes. No! I ran to the bathroom so people wouldn't notice, wash my legs and shoes, and cover my shorts by tying my sweater around my waist. Chad, this is a classic. If you ever pee yourself or anything like that happens, you just put your sweater around your waist. <laughs> this time I asked a teacher for a pad, and she luckily has some in her bag. Despite my misfortune, 
That's not the most embarrassing part. I still have to run the relay race. So I get past the baton and start running, but my sweater comes undone and everyone sees my bloody white shorts. I know everyone knows because the teachers stopped the race to pull me out and had someone else take my spot. Please! Get this girl some substitute shorts! Holy frick! This is so embarrassing! The only funny part was that the boys looked at me as if they thought I was dying. <laughs> <laughs> this is when men, this is when boys became men, when they found out that periods were real. Emotional oh, no. Fortunately, all the girls who were laughing at me were from different schools, so I don't have to deal with that, but still very embarrassing. That's a sad story. Yeah. I think the most important thing to learn here is that, chat, if you ever didn't bring anything with you, you don't go for the TP. That's never the play. Just ask somebody for, for anything. <laughs> anything, please. <laughs> Yep, yep. Save yourself the embarrassment, Jesus Christ. Don't get it twisted. <laughs> yeah, don't use toilet paper. That's definitely embarrassing. It never Holy works. Shit. There's no females here, fill in. You right. All right, I'm talking to the void right now. <laughs> Holy shit. You know what's pretty cool though? She had like a free like, you know, decals. Like, you know, like when you paint like flames on a car. She got like red stripes for free on her pants. That's pretty cool. What do you think about that one? Yeah! Alright! The girls were laughing behind her because she was beating them. Facts. Chat, listen, if she was in last place, no one would have seen it. But she's in first place, so... It'll make sense. Oh but my imagine there was like... Wait, so it was at the baton race where they pulled her out, right? Because I feel like if yeah. it was one of those long-formed races... Uh-huh. If I had the guts, I would just keep going. As long as I was in first place, I wouldn't give a fuck. I'd be like, yeah. yeah. yeah I'm on my Do fucking you know how metal... <laughs> Do you know how metal you look? You're literally sprinting at Mach 7 and there's like blood flying everywhere. It's like you're crushing your entrails while running. You're going so fast. I mean, if that Holy is not an intimidating shit. giga chat moment, I don't know what is. <laughs> that would be mega respect. I wouldn't give a fuck what people said at that point. Imagine you're running so fast that like the girl behind her just getting like red flecks on her face. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking yucky. <laughs> Face. Holy <laughs> yeah, man, it's like the the blowback, I guess. All right, <laughs> what the frick? I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> All right, uh, I think it's your turn. This is a long one. I'm gonna get some water while you do this. <laughs> back in my last year, why is uh last year uh, capitalized? Uh, back in my last year in high school, our entire classroom decided to go on a beach trip, but just to have some fun and say farewell to some classmates we won't uh we won't probably see in a while. Some of us didn't go to the trip, but I had to because a girl that I had a huge crush on wanted Ooh. to go. There were some hints that she liked me back, but I didn't really notice them. In this beach, there were those floating cottages that you can rent out and stay for the day. This will be important later. We decided to rent out two just for the guys and girls. When we got out in the cottages, uh, when we got on the cottages, would usually be like at a distance and have a rope anchoring us so we wouldn't float out into the ocean. We didn't notice that both of the cottages weren't tightly anchored, and while we were having fun, it decided to rain. At oh. first, it was fine, but the rain started to get heavier, and wind started blowing hard on us, and the waves were getting bigger. Chat, the wind's blowing. All right. The rope that was holding us started to get loose, <gasps> and when we planned to get a bunch of the guys, then the girls to help hold on the rope, myself included, Ooh. while we were holding the rope for dear life. Wait, this is really oddly periods and weird places. <laughs> Jesus, I didn't notice that my shorts actually started ripping because never, it was never, being never, snagged by the cottage. <laughs> so while I was holding onto the rope, I was stark naked in front of the girls, <laughs> including my crush. Okay. <laughs> nice. It's when like, rain it's like Spider-Man or some junk, right? Remember like Spider-Man's trying to hold the ship together with like the ropes on both sides? <laughs> It's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, imagine like the super suit just rips off while he's doing that. He's just like superhero, like, Aah! it's like the same energy. The crush is enjoying the like, show. Mm -hmm. There was an edited video of Spider-Man with all those like certain like moments where he's hanging on to things. Where he dies. The... Yes. Yeah, it's actually so gross. I hate this. It is. Just absolutely atrocious, but really fucking well done. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah, the edits are so good. It's like it's like Spider-Man being an actual human. What happens to you if you try to stop a train? <laughs> yeah. They're yep. so awful. Okay, well, instead of doing that, it's a more humorous take where his clothes rips off, I guess. Uh, all the effing Tom Holland fans really loving that one. 
Uh, so how does the story end? Whenever, whenever. Um, like when the rain and waste started to settle, no one even <laughs> said anything about me being naked. <laughs> I only started to feel it when I was starting to get cold. So, to put it shortly, I was basically naked while my junk was wiggling for everyone to see. Oh! And it's like an effing shrimp, just like. Oh, I, I no. I'd fucking sport it. Be like, hell yeah, I was holding a Yeah, but what did it do, like, right? Oh. At this situation, you just start doing the helicopter, right? <laughs> no. Yeah, like, I mean, I guess at this point, I, like, I, so I'm curious, like, mm -hmm. I feel like, I'm, I'm gonna be really honest, and this might be a bad take, this is probably a bad take, I should probably not say this. Alright, chat, it's gonna be a great really, take. Mm -hmm. Penises look really weird when they're soft. They just look like weird mushroom thingy alien things, so I imagine that's what it looked like at the time, when he was naked, holding on to his cottage, because there's nothing, you know, making it look, you know, like that, so... I imagine that that's why that would be embarrassing because he had, you know, that's what's going through Are my head right now. Are you telling me the only thing this man was thinking is, man, I wish I had a boner right now? I think so because at least he would be like, Lena, yeah, you would you would me. be a giga chat as a guy. I swear to God. I think I would. <laughs> Honestly, I, I, I really. Think I would. If my shorts get ripped off, the only thing I hope for is to be completely erased. <laughs> I mean, because then at that point, you're like, do you like it? Or, uh, like, no? Like, oh, I mean... my God. Lena, you're the type of girl to send your peepee -pee and be like, I sent you my balls, now show me yours. Like, 100%. 100% is me. Yep. <laughs> All right. It's my first live stream. What's up, Byron? <laughs> <laughs> uh, welcome. Hey. Hi. <laughs> uh, let's see. My After that, everyone started laughing at me because of it, and my crush... Uh, though, my crush, though, even jokes about it from time to time, and they now call me the awkward streaker. Well, I need closure. Did, 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 did they get together at the end of it? You know, like... Man, that was so beautiful! The way your dong was ding-dangling, it really got my bells jangling. Like, what happened there at the end? Like, did you guys hook up? Like, was it... Did she approve? Yeah, I don't know. I... I need more information right there, but that's alright. All right, here we go. Uh, uh, uh. So, I used to be part of a swimming club and trained with them a lot. All the way from age 4 to 14. I stopped because it came too much after trained 8 times a week. Okay. Chat, if you effing practice 8 times a week, you need help. <laughs> but as someone who went to swimming often, I discovered a few pee while in the club showers. Um, okay. What? Okay. They were shared in the club. Okay, so there's shared showers and this person is peeing in them. I discovered that the pee became clear and the shower water is clear. So no one noticed. This person figured out if you're hydrated, your pee is clear. Very cool. All right. <laughs> uh, so as far as I'm aware, no one did. But I decided to take this a step further. Around 10 or 11 at the time, we were doing sets at the side of the pool between links. I was on my rest with some of my friends in the club, and we were standing at the edge of the pool in front of the coach, who was in a lifeguard chair. Well, my friends were talking, and I needed to pee, so my mega galaxy five-head brain thought, well, no one knows in the shower because of how clear it is, so why not now? Maybe I'm just dripping wet from the pool, right? Wrong. <laughs> I started, and this gush of warm liquid traveled down my right thigh and straight to the floor. Don't get me wrong, it was clear AF. That boy was hydrated right now. But not only did my three friends who were in front of me notice my piss parade, <laughs> so did the coach, who just looked out at me and said, Don't ever do that again. <laughs> Ah. Oh, what a Giga Chat coach moment! Just looks over like, yeah, man, he's pissing himself. Listen, don't ever do that again. Anyway, make those laps faster, baby! Come on, you gotta get those strokes longer if you're gonna win the cha championship! <laughs> Holy shit. Holy frig. To this day, I still think about it in the car and how crazy it would have looked. Anyway, great stream, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Philly love. Aw, Philly love. I ain't ashamed. Yo, my man owns this junk. <laughs> Nice. Chat, one of you're the coach. <clears throat> I better see a ton of ones for all you guys are Giga Chads. Yo, Skip is in my chat right now. Chat, everyone add Skip me. Type Giga Chad too. <laughs> all right. Good job on being hydrated, man. Yeah, congrats. Let me know how the pee went. Okay. Oh my god, the story is so... You got this. Easy clap. Let's take, let's take it just a, like a, like a, just a momentary, like, let's just... Uh-huh. You can sit down up here. Right, what do you think of the story so far? 
when I think of those stories, you know, I was hoping to like get like a murder confession for drama, you know, be like, to this day, nobody knows I'm the Unabomber. And I'd be like, cool. And then we report them to like NASA. And then Obama like gives me a Medal of Honor. But that hasn't happened yet. So hopefully Donald Trump shows up or something to make this serious drama, you know? Yeah, I mean, we still have time. We still have time. Yeah. yeah. All right, Chad, play the stream outro. <laughs> Do you have an outro? Uh, I have like an outro screen that I play for five seconds. <laughs> it's just like nothing. Uh, do, you, do, do you get like weird DMs on Discord sometimes? I used to, but I did the whole thing where you can't contact me unless we're friends. Oh, yeah. I, I do that when like I, I can't take the DMs anymore because it gets really effing weird. But like I get some really, really weird DMs. This person is just example. like, this person is just like... This person just DM'd me, they're like, Hi, Fillion, I'm a big fan. And I didn't respond because I was busy or whatever. And then they're like, Kill yourself, furry. <laughs> and they're like, You're a furry. Furry, furry, furry. You're a furry. And then I didn't respond. They typed, I love you, Fillion, after. <laughs> it's like, What are you doing? Why are you sending me these weird effing DMs? Yeah, I, I don't know. People send me all the time. They tell me DMs like, Fillion, I love your stream. By the way, my grandma died. <laughs> I don't know what to make out of this either. What do you generally like? Do you just kind of take it with a grain of salt and leave? Or just like sit in your thoughts for a while? Or like, do you like that? I literally click on the DMs, type WTF in my head, and then click off of them half the time. But if you guys are having like a nice DM, like I'll read it and I'm happy for them. But a lot of them are just like, hi, Fillion, want to be friends? <laughs> And it's like, well, I, I wish. I don't know what to do with those. There's like a, a handful of those where people that you've never even like seen or talked to, and they're like, hey, yeah, can we be friends? Can we be friends? Can we be friends? Well, like, what's I, typically what I say is, which is very true, is that like it's not fair to everybody if I do that just for you, you know? And also like you don't yeah. have enough time to do that for everybody, so I think that's like the most fair way to put it. But yeah, they're really weird DMs, and it's kind of funny because like it teaches you the gamut of like scams to like pity bait you. Cause like people will try anything and everything in your DMs to get you to like respond for one reason or another. It's kind of crazy. Yeah. So yeah, if nothing else, I'm not gonna get scammed by like a phone caller, I guess. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fucking. Huh. Just say I don't care. Nice chat. <laughs> Someone's gonna message me and be like, "Bro, my family died. By the way, Phil and you're a furry." And then I'm gonna be like, "I don't care." <laughs> That'd be so metal. <laughs> Wait, I have to know. So does your the the hair band does it go like across like an X? Or are they two like two? What are triangles? they? Like, I have no idea. Uh I think they go across like an X. But I don't I can't see. <laughs> they remind me of the face you make. Can you, the little, like, yeah, yeah, the little X face. Can you see for me? Like, how do they work? Yeah, I think it's an X. I think it's an X. Hmm. It's an X? Nice. Wait, so they're not actual headbands? Well, I don't know. Wait, let, go look this way. Where? That way. Uh, well, my chat's not there. I want to read it. Look that way. Yeah, it's it's an X. Hi, I don't Chad. know if it goes all the way. XQCL. Yeah, X. Bro, you're on the wrong stream. <laughs> Kisser says a new person. Your first message in my chat is to kiss the person I'm hanging out with. I mean, come on, chat. Really? Oh, yeah, yeah, chat. That's effing weird. Chat, why are you guys acting so effing sus? I swear to God. Like... <laughs> yeah, chat! Yeah, that's, that's weird. That's fucking weird. It's yeah, so weird. it's so weird. First time catching a stream. Great to see a fellow Aussie. Yo, my man's trying to dox you right now. <laughs> first message. Yo, what's up, Nick? Huge! Fillion, why you gotta be such a sissy baka? <laughs> Dude, people ship in like five seconds. They're like, you're hanging out with a friend, must be dating. <laughs> I think when we like stand a certain amount uh, to each other, they're like, holy shit, shipped. Wait, slap landed for 10k fruit snacks. <laughs> Wait, no, no, no. <laughs> hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, no, I'm cool. Hey, <laughs> Fillion. Hey, I what? thought we were friends a second ago. I'm cool. I don't want to... Have you met my friend? Who? Uh... <laughs> what? <laughs> He's got a name. What? Who? <laughs> you, you seen the movie called Star Wars? 
Yeah? Yeah, it's the guy, like, with Chewbacca as his friend. Chewbacca's friend? Yeah. You lost me. Chewbacca's friend, if you watch Star Wars. Who's Chewbacca's friend? <sighs> his name is Han! <laughs> <laughs> Holy frick. <laughs> Oh god, wait! Oh! Bro, her neck is snapped eight different ways right now. <laughs> oh, I gotta go. <laughs> the joke failed. I actually committed murder. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. It, bro, this is, dude, this is what you fucking get, Philly, for hanging out with me. Oh. Nothing lands. Nothing fucking lands. Oh. I'm telling you. Yeah, you know what does land? These nuts on your face. Oh! Oh! Oh, frick. I don't want it. I don't want it. Frick. Oh, frick. Ah! Oh, you, you backed up past my wall. <laughs> Got him. Uh, <laughs> uh, you literally just don't walled me on accident. How could you? Or on purpose. Yeah, on purpose. True. She has been calculated that one. She's a maniacal genius. <sighs> Y'all should play Truth or Dare. Maybe next time. You can do that maybe next time. Sit on your walls. Next true. Time. Wait a second. What? Next time. Yeah. Wait, what? Huh? Is it gonna be next time? I. Uh, yeah. You wanna. <gasps> you wanna, like, do it again or. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll be done. So, cool. Let's go. Okay. Well, that was pretty. Easy. Yeah, yeah. People are shy. That was pretty easy. Next time. <laughs> people are shy. I always think I like put a weird taste in people's mouth when I just like nothing hits. Nothing. Nothing sticks. Nothing fucking. When my nuts hit, it puts a weird taste in your mouth. Okay. Never mind. Uh. <laughs> All right. Next story. Let's go. Wait, stop staring at your camera like that. It's not. Uh, uh, come on, we 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 gotta read a story. It's story time. It's like pizza time, but it's like a story. Okay. All right, chat. We're gonna become traditional VTubers now. <laughs> we become 2D VTubers. Hi guys, welcome to the stream. Today we're playing. Uh, we're playing reading stories. I can't move my shoulders. Watch my facial expression. This one's called the Ahigao. Aha! I'm a funny VTuber! What? I still can't move my shoulders! <laughs> Get worst! God damn it! <laughs> oh, oh my god, god. okay. This story is just fucking moving over me, dude. I, uh... I, I'm, I'm, I'm sensing another poop story. What is this one? What do you want to bet it's about poop? I don't know. Uh, what am I betting? One sub. Okay, one sub. Wait, I just lose a sub either way. <laughs> <laughs> Done. No! Done. 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 All right, I'm about to be minus nine. All right, chat, minus story. nine incoming. What's up? To start the story off, during Halloween, me and my family come together to do a haunted house each year. I happen to make my own live corpses for- Wait. What? <laughs> I happen to <laughs> what? Make <laughs> life-like <laughs> corpses. Bro. The, is this you? <laughs> hey, bro. Hey, don't. This uh -huh. is a secret. It's anonymous. Oh. Uh. Uh. I happen to make my own life, uh, life like corpses from old clothes, paint, polyfill stuffing, and gap crack sealer. During the <laughs> summer, I sell fireworks with my family, and it was a very slow day, so I decided to make some of the corpses for Halloween. When okay. they were all made to look like dismembered bodies, I had to put them somewhere to dry. Dude. Luckily, my- <laughs> This is like a serial Look killer confessing. Chad, this is the drama we've been waiting for. Serial killer is coming live on stream to confess. It's IRL Dexter. I cannot believe this. All right. This is what we wanted. It's finally fucking happening. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Chad, call the cops. Okay. Wait, don't actually. All right. Uh, when they were all made- Luckily, my uncle had an idea to hang them up in the garage by meat hooks. Uh-huh. While we were hanging them up to dry, my neighbors had a giant fight and were yelling at one another to the point uh, to the point the police had to come down and intervene. One cop looked at the garage and seen what was hanging from the garage ceiling right before my mother lowered the giant garage door down to where it's just a tiny crack left between the garage door and the pavement. 
few minutes later, the cop called for reinforcements driving up to our... Wait, what is that? What is that? Wait. Can you hear me? Yeah, what's that? What is that? Wait, who is that? Bro, who is that? I don't know. I have hey! my thing locked. Who are you? Who are you? Come over here. Come over here. We're literally live right now on stream. Are you gonna sit there and pose like that? You think you're so cool? Come here. Come here. I can't see you. Show your face. Uh-huh. What? I can't even display their avatar. Uh-huh. Yes. Yes what? Uh -huh. Yes. Bro, get over here. <laughs> yeah, there you are. Oh, look how cool you are. Nah, show yourself to the camera right now. Do the big reveal. Hacked live on stream. This guy just walked in. I have no idea who he is. He's got a gun. Come on, come on, come on. He's got a gun. It's a bunny rabbit? No. He looks like like a, like a no. gusher became sentient and just like pulled out a Glock. Uh, no. Ah. Who, who's this motherfucker? <laughs> are you are you drunk? Oh. Huh? <laughs> Vamos! <laughs> Aquí! Oh! Yeah. What the fuck is that? That's my girlfriend. Now come here. Yeah, oh. she. Oh my God! Stop! <laughs> you little you little midget! <laughs> No, no, back up, back up! You don't come to my friend and embitters it! Yeah, yeah, yeah! A little freak, little... Ah! Pinche perra! Gane tu boca, pendeja! Huh? What's up? Hey, she opened the fucking... She opened the fucking leg for me! No, she didn't! She was literally just sitting there! Enjoy the view? No, no. She was like that, and she's like... What, do you like that? Yes. You're like, oh yeah, I like feet. Why not? Me gusta patas! Nah, nah, pata no, pata no, pata no. Hey, hey, Kanda, what, what are you doing? Uh, we are, are we're doing? reading are like doing? viewers' confessions for how cringe they are. Uh, so yeah, do you have an embarrassing story you want to tell us right now? Yeah, one time I was doing like a, a collab with a, with a fucking uh, stripper cop affiliate. Uh -huh. Fucking sucks. What? Fucking sucks dick very bad. And it was like the worst what? Uh, collab ever in the world. No, it wasn't. And the motherfucker told you, and next week because I had a fucking sponsor stream and she fucking, fucking ignored me in fucking okay. Discord and I'm here. You want to continue with the stream? Yeah, sure. All right, let's do it. Anyway, uh, so then one cop puts his hand onto the gun holster as my mom utters in a very calm voice, would you like to look inside of our garage? One cop replies a little shocked, C can we? Another cop raises our garage door up at first and showing a face of disgust and horror until a few sec- Wait, my music stopped. That's all right. <laughs> And chat, that's Silver. He's a Spanish streamer. He makes a bunch of funny content. He just requested on me, so I said, why not? <laughs> and then he just gets kicked. <laughs> oh, no. The music stops. Bring him back. He's effing dead, chat. There's no bringing him back. We know who he is. It may be. Not everyone does. I remember the Silver collab. True. Paid actor. I could enable his uh, fucking avatar. It was just like this weird little bunny small thing. Yeah, it was a Ugandan Knuckles. Do you know that meme? Ugandan Knuckles? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've yeah. been spit on once or twice. Yeah, he basically like started using Ugandan Knuckles meme and then like his like stream blew up with it. So he had to stick with it being a Ugandan Knuckles and that's his current fate. So oh, if you think your OC is no. bad, at least you're not a Ugandan Knuckles in a military outfit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, it was nice meeting him. Yeah, yeah. He's pretty cool. Uh, he likes to throw around insults and then sexualize women. So all around a pretty upstanding individual, if I said so myself. Good impression, good impression. <laughs> I liked it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right, how's the story going? Um, Halloween decoration. Wait, hold on. Uh, until a few seconds later, he found out that they were just realistic Halloween decorations made by yours truly. Me, my family, and the cops couldn't help but laugh hysterically. One cop said that they didn't know what sort of nightmare they were stumbling upon. My mom then replies back with, We just figured if we do this enough times, we could get away with the real thing later on. What? What? I don't think I would ever say that to the cop. I don't think that's Holy the kind shit. of thing you say to the cop right now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Wait, chat, this is oh, the drama bro. we needed. Oh my god. Mom, no, no, no. Yeah? Well, how does this go forward from here? 
That's it. A true story by JD underscore XD001. <sighs> the end. Oh, that's cool. So, chat, what have we learned today? One, no, that's not a Giga Chat moment. That's a Giga in jail moment. You guys need to understand, right? Suburban life, it makes you build different, bold statement. A chat, imagine if you could, like, speak words and they were, like, bold in real life. Like, that would be the statement for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly. Yeah, man. I, I, <laughs> this guy's like the epic OJ of getting away with weird statements to cops right now. Holy moly. The glove is not it. <laughs> wow. Whenever, whenever, whenever. All right. Oh. oh my god, we made it. We made it? So what? No fucking way. That's it. Oh, wait, I got another story right here. You gotta really? refresh. <gasps> you gotta refresh. Okay, hang on. Hey, it never ends. That's it. Nah, it's not over. Chat, listen. The stream never ends, you fools. You freaks. We're gonna be here forever. She thought this is an epic two-hour hangout session. Absolutely incorrect. We're literally going for five epic years. I added one since you guys started um, streaming. Oh, okay, cool. I don't know if we'll go that long. I think um, I think when I run out, we'll call it. Her feet are so tiny. Whose feet? Oh, what the frick? Wait, you can see her feet. Wait, what is that? What? You're you're doing a fun review on stream right now. Wait, what? Look at it. She has on? feet. True. True. For some reason, um, you have like occlusion, um, or bounding boxes set wrong for your feet. So like at certain angles, it just cuts off the shoes and just shows feet. And apparently, oh, your model's got tiny feet. No, that actually it's it's a real thing. I don't I don't know if they fixed it in this one. Mm -hmm. but yeah, it's like this little weird nub because they made the feet really small to yeah. fit in the shoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's, really, it's really awkward. Aha! Uh -huh. So it reveals the feet reveal sometimes. Whoa, whoa, oh, whoa! Sensor. Okay. <laughs> I got you. Hey, Coxie, get cucked, yeah. idiot. All right. <laughs> Holy freak! All right, so I got a story right now. Do you have it too now? Or are you good to go? Yeah, it's up. Cool. Two days after getting my driver's license, I took my friends out for a drive. Chat, if somebody just gets their driver's license, do not get in a car with them. They're gonna think they're the best effing driver. They're gonna think they're a Speed Racer 2.0 on cocaine mixed with Ender's Game. It's just not gonna end well for you, I guarantee. They're gonna be hitting 80 on like a 40 miles an hour bridge. I swear to God. After we got dinner, it took them back home. As I was dropping off my last friend, he said to me, Dang, you're a pretty good driver already. Cocky as I was, I replied with, Yeah, I am a pretty kick butt driver. Probably better than most people already. Fast forward about 20 seconds as he's watching me from his house reverse into his stepdad's car. Hello there. There it is, chat. There was only one way for this to end. There, <laughs> there was, there was, only, I, I told you, man, there's only one for this junk to end. Oh, that's a good story. I like that one. That's one of my favorites, I think. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. Did you know I've been involved in like 10 different wrecks? That no. wasn't me driving. Chat, I've been involved in like 10 different car accidents before, like, while I was like, like before college even. So yeah, so cool at driving. I don't know what happened, but I've been like, so chat, the worst wreck I've ever gotten in is my friend was driving with his friend and they were going 80 miles an hour on a 40 mile an hour bridge. I kid you not. Now this bridge, it was very high up in the air. There was ground underneath and there was some water underneath. The only problem was that the side rails were literally just like a, like a, like six inches of concrete. So if you uh, spun out and hit the walls on this bridge, there's a very high chance you flip over it and you effing take one last skydive to heaven. You understand? So the car is, like slips out and hits our car while going 80 miles an hour because his friend is driving with him. And our... We're lucky, swear to God, that the car did not spin out. Neither of us spun out, so we barely survived. <laughs> but Holy it was shit. it was actually such a dangerous situation. The thing is, I was in the front passenger seat, and the car slammed into us on that side. So I got hit going 80 miles an hour on my door. And the vibrations I felt were like... Th like, I could feel the car hit us through the door. So, yeah... <laughs> That was a spooky time, but that was the most dangerous wreck. I've been in a bunch of other ones, like small fender benders, backing up into stuff, etc., etc. But there have been a, lo a lot of wrecks that I've been in that weren't, like, not even me driving. So, yeah. A ton of your I've never been in a car accident. A, lot of sense now. <laughs> a ton of your streams making a lot of sense now. Yeah, the brain damage is real. Don't drive with Phil, got it? Yeah, I'm like an effing uh, bad omen or some junk. If I get in a car with you, there's a 50-50 shot of meeting Jesus. 
<laughs> my god. Okay, fucking noted for the future. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. I've been asked by the receptionist in my workplace to meet for lunch and I had agreed to thinking uh, it had to do with the project the department had been working on. She was keeping information for several of us uh, to deliver to different departments. My fault for making assumptions, but I found myself on a lunch date. Not complaining. <clears throat> and pleasantly surprised, I'm pretty dense when it comes to taking a hint. Lunch was normal, and we made the normal mouth noises ab about what we like. Um, and what? <laughs> They're making mouth noises? <laughs> I mean, just, you know, normal mouth noises. No just making deal. mouth noises. Let's go. I've never heard that being described like that before. Yeah, whenever, that's whenever. Okay, we made the mm. normal mouth noises Hi, about what we I like and dislike and all that boring laugh. setup. We made small talk as we exited the restaurant and I figured at this point I didn't have much to lose so I asked if she wanted to get lunch or dinner again later in the week. She turned to me with a big smile on her face and agreed <sighs> to lunch. He's in! Yeah, this has been a pretty good story. It was at this point I subconsciously decided to put my foot in my mouth and start chewing. What? Ex I excitedly exclaimed, have you ever had five guys? The smile fell from her face <laughs> Wait, and her hold up! <laughs> you're like, you're like, oh, you want to go to dinner with me? That's awesome. I don't want to fuck How did you do? <laughs> oh my god, your foot knob is on the camera. Why <laughs> You're eating your foot knob. <laughs> it's like a piece of beef jerky. <laughs> oh my god, I love beef jerky. Chat, this is gonna get clipped 100%. Alright, it's a nugget, true. I actually legit put my shoe in my mouth and I taste like rubber now. Looks like a sausage, true. You wear shoes while you're in VR. Yeah, yeah, because I do flips and stuff. It's better whenever, for my feet. Whenever, 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 like, oh, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, yeah, fair. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Have you ever had five guys? The smile fell from her face and her eyes started to narrow. She almost hissed out, and what does that have to do with lunch? I immediately realized how I had worded my question, and with my face starting to feel warm, I started to stammer a response. No, 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 not like that. I mean, uh, lunch, you said you'd been a while since you had a good burger. You know, we, we can just forget how I worded that. We walked in an <clears throat> awkward silence to end of the block, and as we waited at the crosswalk, I turned to try and ask her forgiveness. Ask and for what forgiveness? Oh, no. My lord and savior of five guys down the street from us. Well, oh, huge. At this point, I'm pretty sure my face was giving off enough heat to give the sun a run for its money and was rather red. Nice. I pointed out and said, see, I just want to know if you had been there. I was trying to imply I cut off as she looked at me, then the restaurant, and then me again and burst into laughter. After letting her laugh for a few minutes, she <gasps> finally said, I'd love to have five guys with Let's you. Let's go! He's in! Whoa! Okay, 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 okay. How does he blow it? How does he blow it? How does he blow it? That, folks, is the short tale of how I embarrassed the hell out of myself and shared five guys with someone. P.S. I thought she might be messing with me at first, but she really had never heard of five guys and thought I was asking sussy casting couch quality questions. Yeah, it's true. Have you ever had five guys? No. Okay, cool. Piper Perry has. Pretty sick. <laughs> Who? What? <sighs> Chat, I'm not explaining this one. There's a lot. No, I'm not. I'm not. We're not explaining this one. This, this one is the one who's, that we let go. Who's Piper Perry? Who's Piper Perry? Parody's nuts. Uh, frick. Let me refresh too. Let me. I, I'm at the end for me. Let me refresh and see if this is it. Do 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 do. All right. Oh, um, here, here. Oh, I see slideshow. All right, we got like a few more. We got a few more, chat. A few more. We got just a few more, and then we're going to call it for the stories. Huge. All right. I was commentating for the eSports at my college, which means it's supposed to be a PG stream. Yeah, we know this is going to end well. PG and eSports do not mix. But my first time doing it was a wreck. I didn't know what CBT meant. <laughs> wait, I, I, wait, wait, wait. What? Oh, oh, okay, yeah, never mind. I thought I didn't know what it was, and then I had to think about it. Sorry, okay. excuse me. Sorry. Oh my god, hello. I think I just made out <laughs> with someone. Uh, <laughs> I know a CBT man, and one of the players in the game had that as their tag. It took someone pulling me aside to explain to me for the final stop, but not before I had said it like 20 times. 
Chat, we all know what it means. Listen, CBT is a really important medical medicinal field. It stands for Cognitive Behavior Therapy. Thanks, Cardo. I really appreciate that. Bail me out, of course. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, I can love CBT, actually. Wait. Okay, well, that's not like... That's, yeah. Uh, I? Like, the therapy. Your rat is really cool, by the way. Like, rat jam. Rad jam, rad jam, rad jam, rad jam. Google is nice to me. <laughs> We're gonna put this one off with a rad jam. Holy moly, how does this man do it? He's like inverting gravity right now. <laughs> how do you look in real life as your maneuver to get the rat? Like, rat jam. <laughs> There we go. Okay. Closed beta testing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're closed beta testing for Overwatch 2. That's pretty sick. Oh, closed beta testing? That yeah, makes yeah, yeah. Logical. Yeah, closed beta testing. We're going to find out if chat's a beta or not. All right. Oh, you. 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 Okay. You. You. I used to do tech support for local courthouses. I did my job well enough. I never really had to talk to anyone. One day, my boss calls me and says they hired a new guy to start taking some of my shifts so I can take days off. Give him the tour, blah, blah, blah. You know, the usual. Uh -huh. This man who looks like he just crawled out of high school asks me, How old are you? You're really smart. <laughs> I try to say, I'm turning 25 next month, but my brain cells trying to work on a normal, uh, trying to work a normal human interaction say, me I'm too. five. <laughs> uh, okay. I mean, I'm turning five. No, I'm at this point, he's walking away and didn't come back the next day. I guess he couldn't handle having a five year old for a boss. They made a movie about this, actually. Did you know that? Whenever, whenever, whenever. Paul no you fucking want. way. Fuck yeah. off. It's called Boss Baby. And that's a wrap. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, baby! We got the jokes on deck. I'm like the Michael Scott of horrible jokes. <laughs> you have used with Lena Wen. I'm down. <laughs> She's coming. All right. Uh, Cooks is going to have a field day with this clip, by the way. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? You said that so fucking casually. She Look, <laughs> chat. Look, she's in a position that's going to get clipped and shipped. Uh, I can already see the title right now. Hi, Obi. Hi, Meme Asylum. Hi, Cooksy. So basically what's happening here is we're experiencing childbirth. <laughs> I don't know. Cooksy goldmine. Yeah. Wait, what the frick happened? Holy boss. Wait, did, is it over? Wait, is that, is that was that the last one for you? Let me see. Tech support? Yeah, that's the last one. Oh, huge. All right, that's it. Well, mother chuckas, I guess we made it to the very end. We made like it through 50 effing stories. Uh, so that's pretty crazy. When she's pregnant, I don't know. Clipping and shipping. Yeah, that last one was for the road. Oh, oh, she's pedaling, she's pedaling, she's pedaling. <gasps> Let's go. Can you change into Lil Phil? Sure. We'll see what Lena thinks about it. Okay. Have you seen Lil Phil? Oh, you have. Of course you have. Never mind. Yeah. This is an effing spoil. All right, whatever. Chat, I forgot. I actually hang out with her off stream. What do you know? <laughs> <laughs> All right, then show her cop fill in. I'm not busting out cop. Oh my god! Holy! Hi! My name's Little Phil. I want to be your friend. What's that? Ah! 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 Stop! 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 Jesus Christ! Hey, Lil Phil. It's me. I... I can't... Oh, what is wrong with you? I don't know, sometimes I just do that whenever I meet people for the first time. Chat, listen! She's the person from the marble story, except I was the marble. <laughs> I just, you know, you just look so tiny and cute. I had to, you know, give it a shot. You're so lucky. You can I just beat you? No! Put, just me put me oh, down! Put me oh, down! Put me! Put me down! I don't want to be here. I'm not Simba. Wait, Lenny, you're shaking too much. Oh, fuck! Oh, oh. Sorry. I, I, sorry. I. Look, you're too fucking small. You I'm know, sorry. you know, boss baby. No, I'm like drop <laughs> baby or yeah, I have brain damage. <laughs> oh my god. Here, 
Okay. Yeah. That was traumatizing, true. What? Okay. What am I doing? Are we done? No. I'm just sitting here. Cool. You're not gonna drop What'd me, you are you? What? Uh, there's oh. no way. I'd never drop you. Okay. Now what? No, I'm just kidding. Sorry. I'm not no, I got you. Don't okay. worry. Stop! I'm, I'm getting down. Stop! I'm getting down. It's like the no. Tower of Terror, man. I can't do this. Ah. <laughs> uh. I was just fucking around. Alright, fuck. Ah! Sorry. Someone played a loud noise. That was spooky. You got uh, the teeniest little feet. Yeah, I get it. I get it. No, no, no. Listen, that's not me. This is the real me. Okay. <laughs> Stop. Alright, mother tuckers. Uh, so, I think that's pretty much it for all the stories. I had a lot of fun, though. Uh, so. Yeah. Poggers! Pretty much how'd all you, uh, mm -hmm. How'd you feel with like a mixture of like a zoomer with a boomer? Is, is that something you've done before? This is sounding very sus right now. Why are you doing finger guns at me? Okay, we didn't well, touch tips. started like this and okay. then I started. Wait, wait, do the yeah, fingers again fun. like that? Do the fingers like that again? Watch this, watch this. Flick. What's a field goal? Get it? That was pretty cool. Oh, that was pretty cool. I'm really I'm, impressed. I'm Holy a shit. pretty cool kid. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, you are. You're a really cool kid. Like, yeah. there's so many traveling today. I feel <laughs> really educated. Yeah. All right. I'm super duper tired. Probably you are too. But I think that's yep. about it for me. Yeah, man. All right, plug. Hey, guys. Yeah, chat. Let me know if you guys enjoyed like this kind of stuff. I want to do like more stuff with people where like we do stuff like this with you guys. Like we can do like confessions. We can do like desktop rating. We can um I don't know. Like we can get like any stories that you want, Tbh. Um, we can do like frick. Oh, like, there's like a million options. So let me guys if you know if you guys enjoyed like this format. Um, feel free to like message me on Discord or like at me on my Discord or whatever. But that's pretty much it. I had a lot of fun. So anyway, yeah, much goes. If you guys don't know Lena, she's rated me twice. I've rated her like once, so she's currently winning. But that is pretty much it for me. She's awesome. You guys should check her out. She has a lot of scary yeah, VTubing stuff, and she's got a bigger chest than me. So obviously, you should go. <laughs> uh, and that's about it. Yeah, thanks Thanks for uh, um, for putting this together, Billion. I had a good time. <gasps> she dabbed. <laughs> Wait, wait, you want to like a mo like a anime picture moment? We're going to dab at the yeah. same time. Ready? One, two, three! Oh, wait, can that I try again? I didn't know you were holding it. Okay, yep. Uh. No, it was kind of three billion. Wait, okay, okay, how about this? How about fusion, huh? Oh, right. okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. so we just dab though, okay? Ready? Fusion, okay. ha! My entire yeah. chat's dabbing instead of typing dies of cringe. <laughs> Where did I go wrong? <laughs> I like this. Yes. Yeah. Yes. It's pretty fun. Thanks, guys. All right. We're all going to hop out. We'll see you later, later. But it was really fun. See you. Have a good rest of your stream, etc., etc. All right. I'll probably end in a Bye. sec. Okay. Bye. Dun -dun 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 -dun. <sighs> all right, chat. I'll be out of fun with Elena. Uh, she's pretty cool. Um, oh, I'm still on Discord. Wow. Yeah, I'm, I'm, yo, what's oh, up? Hey, uh, <laughs> hey, uh, yo, so like, oh, okay, she left. <clears throat> uh, where's my camera at? Environment? Hello! Okay, mother truckers! <laughs> so I think this is pretty much gonna be it for me today. Um, for real, for real, for real, let me know if you guys enjoyed it, and, uh, I might do this in the future. I wanna do more stuff like this with other, like, people who, who um, are down for it. So yeah, if you're watching and you're down, just hit me up. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Um, feel free guys to join the Discord if you're interested, by the way. I post when I stream, you can get notified when I'm streaming. And uh, I chat there basically every day. We also do stuff like game nights and movie nights sometimes. So if you wanna join the Discord, we'd love to have you be a part of it. It's just discord.gg slash fillion. It's in the chat right now. And also in the description of the stream, there's an about section slash just underneath the stream. There's a big old fat button that says Discord on it. You can't miss it if you see it, all right? So feel free to check out the socials, join the Discord, etc., etc. And I will see you guys in there for a little bit right after this. But that is it. I have to pee really badly. Chat, I made this entire stream without going to the bathroom once. I feel like this is literally making me so tired. <laughs> the fact that I need to go to the bathroom. Uh -huh. 
But yeah, be safe, friend. True. I enjoyed my stream. Thanks for the stream. No problem. No problem. Blow your nose for once, Jesus. <laughs> How about you blow? Never mind. Are yeah, you enjoying the stream so much? Yeah, I think um, like Portal 2 was a different kind of stream. I feel like this is a different kind of stream. I'm just experimenting with new stuff, seeing what you guys like, and uh, what also is really fun for me. But I'm not gonna lie, this was unceremoniously a really, really fun time for me. So thank you guys. First stream, you loved it? Yeah, nice. I would love to see you guys come back again. We're gonna be streaming on Wednesday. We're either gonna be doing OTK game night, or if that's not happening, we are going to be um, doing maybe the Ring Fit stream, actually. Might do a Ring Fit stream on Wednesday. I have everything ready for Ring Fit. It's just a matter of like when is the right time for it. So, yeah. One of the two. One of the two. All right, mother truckers. All right, let's go find somebody to raid. Don't pee under a desk. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um. So where do I want to go right now? The question Good is, night, is Lana Phil. still streaming or is she awesome done? Stream as always. Thank you. Um. No, 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 no. I don't know who to raid. Uh, I think Lana's probably gonna be ending in a sec if I had to take a guess. So we'll find somebody else to raid. Dun 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 dun. dun. Um. Who do I follow on Twitch? Television. Uh, let's find somebody new. Let's find somebody new, eh? Let's find somebody new. VTuber tag. Browse. Oh. VTuber. Damn. My favorite part is when you called someone in college old. Oh, Chad, XQC is a VTuber. Let's raid him. <laughs> um? Hmm. Oh, Kendo's streaming. Chad, let's raid Kendo. Let's go say hi to Kendo. We'll, we'll, we'll tell you guys over to Kendo. Kendo had surgery recently, so he hasn't been um, able to move too much, but I think the surgery went well, so he's good to go. So chat, we're gonna say hi to Kendo. He is a Spanish streamer, and uh, he speaks Spanish. So if you're interested in that, or wanna learn Spanish, et cetera, et cetera, feel free to go check him out. He's awesome. And that is it. Thank Thanks you guys for the, the bits and the subs. No problem. Dance. Thank you guys for all, everything. All right. And thank you for lurking just being here. I will continue to do my best to make stuff that you guys enjoy. So that's pretty much it for me. All right. Peace out, Girl Scouts. Yo, what's up, Melody? <laughs> Yo, Melody, you want to do something fun together? Let me know. All right. Ready, set. I'll see you guys all later. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye. Dun, 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 dun. Outro. Play. Bye, friends.